Facebook coming over saying hi. Welcome to the Rule of Cool. I am the DM of the Rule of Cool, Brian Kuhn. And we're continuing on with the Caretakers of Atoa, a homebrew uh, 5e campaign. We are now finally on episode, I think, 23, 24. 24, I think. It says 23 right up here, though. Does it? Does. I'd have to check. But <laughs> anyway, <laughs> uh, last week, I'll go ahead and give the quick recap. Uh, last week, uh, Ren and Marnin were accompanied by Kath, Mike, and Earth. Earth. Earther. <laughs> Earther. Earther. Uh, to basically Earth. get Kat's honor. Fought some elementals, came out ahead. Yeah. Eventually. <laughs> Eventually well, is right. One thing that they did not know. Kath got the uh, Berserker Axe. Got, uh, and failed his will save and started attacking them. Yep. They very was... smartly decided just to basically... Dogpile on on him and choke him out. Wait, what? <laughs> we're talking about last week, Dave. Well, Recap. we're going to go over here. Uh, basically, we'll say that uh, everybody got back. Uh, Kath went to see Zin Zanat. Yeah. Oh. And we'll start up uh, the game there. Uh, we are going... Uh, our cast tonight is going to be Mr. Guy playing... Excuse me, Mr. Guy, playing <laughs> Lenorius, uh, somebody who's going to be very exhausted by the end yes. of the night. <laughs> uh, Rudy playing Damien, who's going to be exhausted for different reasons by the end of the night. I'm already exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, Heather playing Ren. Um, which, yeah, last last week, <laughs> oh, last week was so much fun. But yeah, Heather's playing Ren, who basically uh, was a meat shield last week. Pretty much. By the way, they can see your dice rolls and anything that you say in the chat now. I changed that. Oh, Woo! Perfect. Nice. I see that? It looks nice. That look. Yeah. That does look nice. It's very sharp. <laughs> Uh, we also have Dave playing Holmes, who, yeah, fiddlesticks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, who's arriving okay. back from the wherever he's at? He's coming back from the. He's coming back from the Cavern of Souls. <laughs> Go check out <laughs> Big Box Dave's <laughs> channel. MTG Attitude. You'll figure out why that's so funny. Have I, material, have I materialized yet? Uh, not yeah, yet. We're yeah. just doing our intros. And then um, Marnin uh, being played by Tony, uh, Tony oh, um, who last week couldn't figure out maybe a curse can be removed by remove curse. No. <laughs> maybe. Yeah. I had him roll really? because we know how good he is. And we know how... Uh, how good the cleric is. He rolled, I said, okay, he has a DC of five. He rolled a four. <laughs> I'm good like that. We started out talking about how you're my best friend and it makes him upset. <laughs> that too. <laughs> but my best we'll uh, start up. Um, <laughs> basically, our players. They are uh, getting geared up and ready for the next uh, adventure. Um, and to go over to Winston's place, the proprietor of uh, the, what is it? The, uh, let me check. I always forget. The, the leaky the foamy tap, the, fo the foamy griddle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. That's my stage name. <laughs> Uh, the <laughs> foaming <laughs> fill <laughs> pub, because he yep. has a way for nipples. you all to get into the city. That's right, because they don't. Uh, the place that you guys are going to doesn't like guild members for whatever reason. Oh, darn. shocker! I don't like guild members either. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he is one, right? 
Listen, I am not. don't hit the player, hit the game. <laughs> I, don't recall, exactly. I, don't recall, I don't recall ever being a guild member. I'm just saying. Just saying. <laughs> you passed the test, you're a guild member. Yep. <laughs> Technically, you are one. But uh, the they are... are fine. <laughs> Supposed to be going to what is the name of the town? Zinda, where they have the uh, jelly of wine, which goes for about 500 gold a bottle, which was I just randomly handled, uh, handed to Damien yeah, by right. uh, <coughs> Tenarius. Which Damien got a, a little bit more background on uh, the vision that he got uh, two weeks or three, four weeks ago. <clears throat> And so, they had a very lovely, slightly tense conversation of like, yeah, I'd love to help you with this, help you break this curse. This shit gets me hard. I love it. But if you try to betray me in any way, I will fucking murder you and love it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Paraphrasing. Lawful, uh, lawful evil, evil gets it done. Yeah, That's anyway. <laughs> <coughs> I will start up with both uh, Marnin and Ren. Uh, basically coming in at the end of the day and uh, going into the cafeteria and Holmes is there and we'll say he pops in as you guys walk into the cafeteria. <laughs> and basically at this time, because of everything that happened, um, it is dinner time and Lenorius, you are finally finished in the brothel. <laughs> or we called it last week the uh, Barthel. Yep, yep, Barthel. <laughs> the spirit Barthel. is willing, but the flesh is bruised and spongy. Mm, and of course, Heather, truth. thank you for the sub. You get to choose who gets uh, who gets that. My bestie. <laughs> <laughs> Bank those twenties. I'm gonna fuck somebody up. It's not me, cause I'm your bestie. Nope. <laughs> Never. But... You get all the haste. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyway, we'll start. Uh, and uh, Rudy, uh, Damien had just finished putting in his last spell. Ah, okay. Uh, he's kind of and like it is absent dinner time. He's absent mindedly twiddling the uh, stick of Holmes' banishment in his hand as he's <laughs> writing in the last spell. Uh, fantastic. Uh, I could go for some nice. Uh, yeah, carb carb car carb 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 We're gonna carb load. Close the book. He's gonna head out. It's carb mm -hmm. launch. And then his home pops. Then I'm gonna say, "Geez, I almost stepped on you. You gotta be careful when you do that." Hey, what's up, Holmes? We're what's grabbing up, some man? food. What are you doing? Oh my god, I'm almost as small as freaking Ren's penis. And I go over the cafeteria line. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Woo, By the way, I'm do sorry. you have your uh, sword out hanging I'm around like, you or not? Right, it's a compliment. I'm five foot four. <laughs> I, Jesus. I, I, I'm a lady. Have you oh. forgotten? Yeah, since uh, like you'll you. see, uh, you'll see the uh, new members in our world. Um, they'll be sitting down, both uh, Mike and. Irith and uh, Kath is going to go over to Zinzanat be like yeah I, I I guess I'm cursed so I'm going to go talk to him see if he can get this off of me I'm going to do my normal go pile up a uh, a the big, actually I need a plate just, I'm going to ask them for a big wooden tray and just and say this is for Kath and <laughs> this is what I do every time I get in the cafeteria I just get make Cath, a big plate of food. The cafeteria. Or the cafeteria. <laughs> I like I like that. I like that. Uh, that but is the exact reason why I named him Cath. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm. No, I I, I, I built Cath a huge tray of uh, good good fixings. Just grits. Nothing but grits. <clears throat> Not uh, lots you of grits see, and gravy. Like, anybody who walks in there, you will see that Cath has a huge ass hammer. Instead of his normal greatsword now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's big. <laughs> By the way, Ren, I don't make the penis comment. That was out of game. <laughs> <laughs> I think, that, I think that if it was out of game, I think that's worse. 
Ren's, probably... Ren's got a new Ren's got a new weapon. It's called a holes. <laughs> <laughs> gonna go full Hulk Loki. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Puny Bad Loki. friend. <laughs> puny human. <laughs> or puny god. Way. Puny god. <laughs> great, great part. Great part of the movie. <clears throat> Uh, once I'm done piling up food, I will walk uh, very lightly over to uh, Cal. Yeah. No. And by the way, this is the uh, weapon that Kath has on his back right now. Oh, nice. Oh, very nice. Yeah. It's got a dude's head on there. That's pretty cool. It's got two dudes. This weapon is a combo piece, right? For its full effect? Yep. Damn straight. Nice. And he already Ooh, has... Uh, one piece of it already. <laughs> is it the belt? Uh, it, it, he already ha- uh, he already had the. He has uh, the bracers. Oh no no he yeah he has the bracers right now. Gotcha. But he's gonna go to go talk to Zinzanat first. Basically, he's got Thor's hammer. <laughs> More or less. Uh, essentially, once you get all the items. <laughs> he's only missing one. Shouldn't be. Oh, he's got. He just needs he's a got, belt. He's got Thor's hammer, but in Diablo. Where you have to collect all the other pieces. Got to get like right. the fucking to make the to mm-hmm. make the set work. Got it. <laughs> is is Zinzanet in a different location other than the? Uh... He's in the cafeteria. Okay. Perfect. All right. Set the tray down for the counter. Because <laughs> yeah, they, uh, just... they decided to hide his his axe from him, so he could never get it back. Is the axe cursed? Yes. The axe yeah, that he had well, last uh... week was cursed. Yep. Oh, that's how, that's how we got the curse. Got it. Having yeah. to fight that a hole. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he that guy sucked. <laughs> had to grapple him. You had to grapple Cal? Yeah. For all of us. Oh, it's gonna be a rumble tonight. <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah, we did the that, dog pilot. <laughs> that's a good yeah. one. I like that. So oh. we'll go ahead and uh, start <clears throat> off. Uh, Lenoris, what are you doing right now? I am happily making my way over to, uh, to the, uh, the buffet and getting some food and not even caring that Zinzanat is there. Had a good night. <laughs> it's not even night. It's just dinner time. All right. <laughs> well, I had a you good, used I had a good five day. hours, five hours getting laid. Yep. That's why I'm happy. <laughs> Normal, normally if Zinzanat's there, I'm causing trouble, but you know what? <laughs> Don't even care. <laughs> I and, wouldn't say uh, tired. Did, and uh, Damien, did you just walk out to get dinner as well? He did, yeah. Okay. So yeah, you guys are all in the cafeteria. Kath is uh, talking to Zinzanet. Um. And again, you do have the... Uh, <clears throat> oh, what are they? Stuff. Things. Um, corkscrew. <laughs> They're, uh, they have opened up their shop. That's right. The deal we signed with them where it's like, hey, you're going to get these grenades and any problem. Which was only like six, seven hours ago. Yep. Yep. And I just realized I I do have my, I look, I have two spin downs. It's like, oh, here are my ports. So. (laughs) Forgot about that. (laughs) 16 and nine. So, yeah, you guys all uh, basically entered the cafeteria. What are you guys doing? Grabbing some food food and filling my face. Yep, fell into uh, my face. Damien's gonna walk over to Lenoris as he's like just piling up with only I can assume <clears throat> some greasy, fatty, heavily protein, like not even remotely healthy for you foods. Bacon covered in butter. Yeah, uh, God. <laughs> uh, in real life, my heart twitched when you said that. Yeah. Good. <laughs> in real life, uh, that's what I would eat. Bacon wrapped I... butter. Oh, yes. Uh-huh. Right. I mean, I, yeah, I, did just, right I, did, I did just buy a can of Spam that has bacon in it today, so I really can't judge, but... Uh, <laughs> That's deep, tough, bro. <laughs> Deep-fried butter wrapped in bacon. Oh, God. We, oh. I, know the big, I know the biggie yeah. started, but Jesus. <laughs> Extra crispy. Lenoris, uh, I, I, uh, I, I can recognize the walk of one so freshly fucked. Uh, perhaps <laughs> maybe you need to hydrate. Uh, okay. I mean, sure. I. Where are we going with this one? Yeah. I I'm suggest... not even. Anyway, it's out of game. Yeah. I, I'm seriously suggesting you might hydrate. You've been 
Look, I, I can see your bruised pelvis from here. <laughs> I'm just going to kind of move my shirt to cover that up. Like, no, no, you can't. Uh-uh. The real question is, Lord Norris come out of there still wearing pants. <laughs> I assumed he was like full dick out. <laughs> exactly. Thousands and that's going to kill you. <laughs> well, that's not good odds. <laughs> you roll a one. Oh, no, no, we roll rolled a 10. 10 out of 100. There's a 10% chance I have pants on. <laughs> you just got a cod piece on. Holy one. shit, that's a high number. <laughs> wow. Yeah. For Damien. Yeah, it's pretty high. But uh, what are you guys doing? I'm curious to find out whether Lenore still has pants on. <laughs> I was we were going to say that he, he may up? have underwear on, but he definitely does not have pants. <laughs> they're more like, they're like shorts. Yeah. <laughs> they're like jorts. Yeah, yeah, jorts. Jorts. I, hydrate for one. I Like you're wafting. I, I, I can <laughs> I can smell. And, and two, you're, you're going to need to hydrate. And three, uh, after a while, were you just shooting out sawdust? <laughs> A little bit, you know. <laughs> gotta, yeah. you know, you gotta get it off where you can. All right. Well, please drink some water or something, and maybe I'll let you have that. What is it? Jelly wine? Oh, wine! I like the word of wine. No, I said maybe you can have some wine if you hydrate. Water, drink now. All right. Cool. I'm gonna get some water. <laughs> <laughs> Well, his tray's unguarded. I'm going to smooth the bacon aside and move some greens on there. <laughs> like something that's not going to give him a fucking heart attack the next year. I'm, uh, I'm going to immediately see that. And when he's not looking, I'm going to move the greens off. I'm going <laughs> to fill it back with bacon. And I'm going to use prestidigitation to make everything look like greens. <laughs> <laughs> that that's good. probably worse. Oh, yep. that's great. Yeah, it looks like greens to me, dog. <laughs> Good job, Lenores. Yeah. You're eating healthy. I am. Wow, these, are the, these are the best crunchy peas I've ever had. Hang out with that, <laughs> that chick more often. Yeah, and yep. yep. uh, yes. David's just going to get food and go sit down at the table. I also, uh, I also grabbed some bread while I was up there, and I'm feeding Mr. and Mrs. Nibblesworth. Oh, shit. Forgot Mr. Nibblesworth anymore. did not go in with you. Mrs. Nibblesworth did. No. Well, I, I would assume back at the cafeteria, if if he made his way, <laughs> you know, I got some bread for both of them, whichever one shows up. Like I said, Mrs. Nibblesworth is definitely there. All right. So I'm feeding her, like, in my coat. <laughs> Maybe you should tell Mrs. Nibblesworth, Nibblesworth to bring some up. Be a nice gesture. Get some pants. <laughs> And, and, yeah. Yeah. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's all this judging about the pants and stuff? <laughs> I mean, it's a common area for everybody to be here and, you That's... know, no. Feels very judgmental. Uh, well, it's a free area. I am free of pants. So uh, we roll. He's pork and pig style in it. <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to keep on going to another table. I'm just like, okay. <laughs> is, you, you is do whatever. There... Is there a lot of important people around Zen with Kath? Uh, it's just basically uh, him and Kath. Okay. Which actually, I, I... right about this time, you will see uh, Zen Zanat um, cast a uh, spell on Kath. Cast a spell on you. <laughs> now you're mine. Because he does have remove curse. Nice. I heard somebody else did too. It's well as soon as as soon as the curse is removed, I do my normal. And I and I lick Kath. <laughs> that's our normal that's how we do like the first time he ever, you know, saw me appear, he sniffed me and licked me. So I did it back to him. So every time that I come back in, I sniff him and lick him. Yeah. So no, it's fine. It's, it's like you do that, Kath just looks at you. Like, like you, like you look up and he just looks at you. He's like, "Oh, so you're back? <laughs> yeah, I brought you food. I brought you food." <laughs> then when you see when he sees the food, he'd be like, "Yay!" 
and just <laughs> grab the plate. Uh, there you go. <laughs> and he's going to run yeah. off, and he's going to sit down with a uh, a lizard and a half orc, which you have not met yet. Mm. I believe it's half orc. A lizard yeah. and a half orc? Okay. I, I, I'm going to go back to the group and just do my normal... Uh, yeah, a lizard fight. My, my, my uh, normal listening. I want to. I want to listen for some any gossip and any juice going on. Juice? Yeah. yeah. It's a weird yeah. way to describe it. <laughs> you mean tea? You want someone to spill tea? Mm. <laughs> um, really? I mean, hey, Lenore's is firing <laughs> blanks. I'm. I'm good around him. <laughs> yeah, so you I'll, don't. I'll, I'll, I'll hang you don't want my juice. Uh, <laughs> Quinn and his group is there, and. Uh, so is Aqua's group. Quinlan, that's a, that's a group we hate, right? No, they're the no. ones there with the rabbits. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Never mind. Never mind. I'm thinking of somebody else. Yeah, you're thinking of else. the Parsons. Because you guys just hate them for some reason. I don't hate them. I just mistrust them. Yeah, yeah. same. Which is fair. Trusting them is, yeah. It's not that we have trust issues. We just don't trust anybody. <laughs> All right, so we'll just continuing on with my plate, and I'm just going to go sit by myself at a table, because I'm tired. <clears throat> this is a long couple-hour journey. I'm going to slide over on the other side of the table from Lenoris and go, so, looks like you did better than I did at the uh, Yield Barthel. <laughs> oh, my God, let me tell you, man. It was such a great time. There were some Ds that were putting some As, and then there were some As that had a bunch of Ds. <laughs> you know, it... I can explain it with letters all day long, but wow, what a good time. Yeah, that's, I, that's wow, wow, wow. impressive. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> the things you choose to remember. <laughs> I know, right? It was so, like you just filled this cavern of souls, and after a while, now it smells like a marsh flats. Okay, I'm, that's it, you're dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to point out uh, the <laughs> lizard and the uh, half orc over there. We just went on an adventure with those guys. Nope. And wow. Notice the monocle on the uh, lizard. Wow, 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 You'll notice wow. that the monocle does not have a lens. <laughs> but doesn't he look fancy? So he just has a rim around yes. his eye. Like, yes. I, like, he looks at the Monopoly guy without a lens. Exactly. <laughs> Mr. Peanut. Yeah. Or, or Mr. Peanut. Well, well played. <laughs> <laughs> Which doesn't exist anymore because people have peanut allergies. Doesn't mean he doesn't have to exist. He's gone. <laughs> He's dead. They killed him. They got rid okay, of the allergy. Okay. <laughs> did you just do that with a piece of bacon, <laughs> guy? No, I did that with my my, my ring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very good. <clears throat> All right. Do not pass go. Do not collect hundred dollars. So. Uh, <laughs> You guys went on an adventure with them. What you guys? What you guys end up doing? Uh, we had to get Kath's honor back, and he, he got had honor. cursed. And he had honor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, yeah. he. It was weird. He got this big ass hammer, not the one that was on his back. So it was. It was definitely interesting because, well, Ren surprisingly actually showed up to the bar, and we got the chance to talk since my time was way less than yours in the Barthel. So sure, yeah, yeah, there's that. Some of us got the skills. <laughs> Some of us had <sighs> shit rolls on twenties. <laughs> yeah. Hey, look, I, I got the skills, man. I'm just saying. <laughs> Is it just a, a bard thing? Who said anything about it being a bard thing? I'm just saying I got the skills. I didn't say oh. anything about being a bard. Bard doing bard things, right? Ah, <laughs> uh, I, I, I was just thinking it was a Lenoris thing. Oh well, there's that. <laughs> so do I hear any interesting poop out there while I'm just listening around Brian or am I just wasting my time <laughs> um you'll basically uh, go ahead roll perception okay yay I like perception uh, what, hold on. Uh, abilities right no skills uh, yeah skills perception. Yeah, yeah, there we go. That's it. Oh, oh nice. 20. 
Nice. Yeah, 30 all together. Here we go. So. <laughs> Uh, certain certain things things that you'll part up, in the corner. <laughs> certain things that you'll pick up um, is that you'll find that Aqua's group more or less are kind of pissed off at Marnin. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, basically do? saying that how can they uh, he uh, get blessed by the uh, by they all had the same god. But he, he's the only one that can talk to him. Um, ah, it happens. Quinn's group, they're uh, basically like they're just sitting there. Um, the female of their group is, uh, you would probably think based off of what she's saying, that she's planning on trying to kill them at some point in time because she's pretty pissed off at all three, uh, all three of them. Darius is uh, gonna go murder. <laughs> Jesus Christ, what? This is all I do from sitting here? Wow, man. <laughs> you got a nat 20. You got a 30. <laughs> Come on. Awesome. He's got like the um, fucking thing that's like picking up the sound. <laughs> and uh, Hold on, I'm hear, gonna drink this. You'll hear oh, uh, Cork's group. They'd be uh, basically they're trying to figure out. Well, three of them, you'll hear three of them. They're trying to figure out how they can. Um, get a uh how to uh build like they're talking about building an armory of magical weapons and they're trying to huh. figure out how to get that <coughs> okay uh but uh, you'll like there's only you only hear three voices and they'll be making fun like one of them will probably make a crack at their other compatriot, Frank, who's out getting raw supplies. Damn it, Frank. Hmm. The, the one that concerns me is the, 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 the in the Quinton's group. The girl wants to kill all three of them. <laughs> um, is Quinton the leader, or I guess I, I've never met the, you, you, the rabbits, right? Yeah, these are the rabbits. You met them briefly. They're the uh, okay. Quinton was the one that arm wrestled Ren. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I I the other three didn't really have much of a part there, but you would be able to notice that one of them, like the female of the three, uh, she doesn't seem to like her group because it's a bunch of go uh, idiot guys. And they're like making comments towards her. Like, is she hot? No, like she's she's average. Tomboy. Yeah, mm. she's a tomboy. Uh, tomboy's okay. Is she hot? <laughs> Show me potato salad. She's hot. <laughs> she's all right. To Lenoris, everybody is hot. <laughs> Even the four really is like scale. a ten. <laughs> Yeah, it's definitely a sliding scale. Listen, a, four, a four is somebody's eight, let's be honest. Right, yep. <laughs> and that averages out to a six for me. But that's basically yeah. what you pick up, Holmes. Okay. I mean, I, um, did Marnin know about that? Like, it, 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 like it paid Marnin. That's something you'd have to talk to Marnin about. Yeah, but Marnin, uh, how are you with Aqua in a group? They're they're not a big fan of mine. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that? Uh, well, you know, I I dubbed uh, Luna Luna. <laughs> and uh, okay, uh, so you know? Oh, I, yeah. They're, oh, because they're talking but, bad shit about you right now. Oh, they are. Uh, you know, they've been dumping on Mark. But, uh, Listen, I'm I'm not trying to start a fight. I'm just letting you know. So if something happens, that's probably the cause of it. I don't, guys. Listen, I just fucking appeared out of nowhere, and I went, and I just learned all this shit. Okay. Right, and then Ren's walking back over to the table. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and and you see that one over there? That that girl, whatever her name is. There we are. She she fucking hates those guys. She what? might be useful. She might be useful. Who hates who? That, that, quit, quit. She's a, uh, she is an elf. <clears throat> oh, really? 
<laughs> yeah. The females <laughs> and elf in her group. Wait a minute. How can you have an average looking elf? They're like beautiful. That's why. I, I, that's what I'm saying. That's why. For <laughs> Lenoris elf, rolled the 92. She's average. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. okay. But yeah, I'm just going to sit down and kind of move everybody out of the way a little bit. And that, and, and, that, and, that, and that group over there, they're trying to build a magical weapon. Oh. Really? Well, yeah. Yeah, it's an armor. They're artificers. So, I just, I, I, and I say it all quiet. Yeah. All three things. Everything I just learned, I just go, bleh, to them. Kind of spin them up. Okay. So you're gonna so, go out and find more information and just let us know every time you hear something new. <laughs> sure, go to walk around and learn some more information. Da, 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 da. <laughs> and and, and as, as I leave, I throw Lenoris's plate right in his face. <laughs> that was rude. I probably deserve that for some reason. I just don't know what it is right now. Mm. <laughs> it doesn't seem like you care even. Uh, Can't you figure it out yet? I. <laughs> no care in the world, I, huh? I, I don't I don't throw I don't throw the plate. Uh, <laughs> no. That was very much out of game. <laughs> <laughs> but at about this time you'll like most of them are eating. Uh Kath is you're gonna see that he's gonna be uh going up to the magic shop. Or I excuse me, Kath. the uh armory. I follow Kath. Are you gonna try to hide it? No. No, it's okay. just wood. Walk side by side with him. This is like, so, uh, I like Cal. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to follow him, but uh, kind of be hidden. Like, okay, kinda... go ahead, roll stealth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, they know I'm there, apparently. Yeah. You probably trip over a chair or something like that. But then when you lay, lay on the floor, you just pretend you're bored. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to see here. Move yeah. along. Move along. Move along. I, Nothing to say. I, I, I actually asked Kath if, if it's okay if, uh, if I can uh, accompany. He's like, I don't care. I'm, no, just, uh, I'm just, I need to buy a uh, something new. What are you buying? He's like, I need to buy a belt. Belt. What kind of belt? Um. Sorry, I'm I just hoping to get uh, hoping to get a uh, belt of Hill's giant strength. Hmm. Hmm. What if they don't have one there? I'll have to wait. I'm gonna go over could... to the uh, buffet line and see if they got any of the small breakfast sausages. It's dinner. They don't. Damn. <laughs> what a buffet is this? No <laughs> I, I I let him know uh, if I come across one. I, he he. In, if I come across one and I can have the chance to get it, I will one hundred percent get it. I just rolled this. I rolled a one. <laughs> <laughs> Or what? Just I was being stupid. But no. <laughs> okay. Rolls are more like that. You. <laughs> you were yeah. being the Norris. I rolled a one, a D one hundred. So that oh. was a, a Damien roll of going. Fine, I'll fuck you later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but he's like, oh, okay. I appreciate that. Yep. Anything else you're looking for, man? He's like, no. Okay. Pretty much all I need. Okay. Uh, do me a favor. If you come across in your travels a uh, very light but sturdy uh, armor, hook a brother up. He's like, I, like, I really don't wear armor, so... If I have any extra, uh, you can take a look at it. Well, if you can, if you come across some or uh, appropriate some, uh, let me know. Okay. 
I feel like at this point, Lenoris is going to be bored with this entire conversation and be like, fuck this. And just go to the magic shop. <laughs> I'm just going to hide you by four. I thought they were going to do something cool, but, you know, that's eh, boring. They're just talking about armor and belts. Stupid. <laughs> and then, uh, and then I, and then I go to uh, go back, go to go back to the group, but I actually do trail from afar. What's that? When, uh, and when I, I leave Calf, but like, and I make my way back towards the the cafe or cafeteria, whatever the deep dining facility, yeah, whatever it is. The and then I, I I do the. I turn right back around and I, and I actually do follow Kath from afar. I just want to, I just, I mean, check. you're only like 30, 30, 40 feet away anyway. Because right. yeah. it's the cafeteria <laughs> where the shops are at, also. Oh, oh, okay. So it's like a kind of like a mall. Yeah. yeah. It's the mall food court. Food court. Yeah. Okay. It's we're the a food court. <laughs> yeah. More or less. Okay. There's a Sabaro. Oh, like a Yumi. campus that has like a bookshop nearby, you know. Panda Express. <laughs> and the college I went to. New- Newberry okay. Comics. Subway. Yep. <laughs> <sighs> All not sponsored, but if they want to sponsor us, we'll gladly yeah. take it. Yeah. I'd go for a fucking Sabaro Stromboli. That'd be good. Ooh. Hell yeah. So, uh, yeah, no, I'll, I'll, just, I'll just watch him. I'll, I'll go back to the table. Damien's just going to head off to the bar. The Barthol. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. so if he's going to wink at Aqua and finger gun. <laughs> you pew. were supposed to let her down. He was, but he's not going to because she is useful <laughs> as fuck. <laughs> nice. You know, <sighs> hey, yep. dude, listen, try, try not to have that thimble sized drink. I don't want to peel you off the floor again. <laughs> uh, you know what, Holmes? My apologies. You know what would be great? If you were to just sit and stare at the ceiling for like eight hours and you get a nine. Oh, oh, oh damn. damn. Wow. You gonna have me stare at the ceiling? <laughs> sit and stare ahead. at the ceiling for what eight a hours. Waste, what a waste of a roll, man. <laughs> you know what? As I still stare at the ceiling, I'm like, wow, man, this guy really is stupid. <laughs> He stares at the ceiling. He's like, that really does look like a marsh flat. <laughs> <laughs> Not funny. <laughs> yeah, it is. But yeah, you sit there and you stare at the ceiling. Okay. I stare at the ceiling, but you know what? I listen. <laughs> I keep listening. You absolutely can. Yeah, I can. Because I'm not Never stupid like you. You were stupid. That was worth it. <laughs> totally not worth it. What are you talking about? So I'm heading into the uh, the magic shop, and uh, I'm looking for some scrolls. Okay, go ahead and roll for it. Uh, what do you want me to roll? D100. D100? I'm actually looking for two scrolls, so... But... Okay. Nice. So he's like, yeah, we got a... Uh... Uh, we got all of your second level and your first level. Uh, we do. Uh, we have some third level, but not all of them. Um, what I'm looking for is uh, either feign death or uh, animate object. Okay. And if we combine those two, we get animate death <laughs> or feign object. Prop hunt. I'm pretty sure Fane yeah, yeah. is... Yeah, Fane Death is level 2, level 3. I don't even think it's that high. Uh, uh, well, False Life is the low one. I think Fane Death is level 2. Yeah. <laughs> Fane what? Death. What is going it's on? It's level 3. Okay. Oh. And I'll animate. Because <laughs> he's looking at the ceiling. <laughs> what the shit? What is going on? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just I'm testing my rolls again. Mm-hmm. I'm um, so they do not have anime objects. Because that's level five. 
And I don't know if you could even afford that. But they do have uh, the feigned death. How much uh how much you looking for for the, the feigned death? <clears throat> feigned death. Uh one hundred. All right, I'll take it. One hundred gold. Yeah. Yeah, that should have been actually the question. That's what I assumed. Yeah, one hundred gold. <laughs> one hundred scroll of anime objects. But it goes back like twenty three hundred. All right, that was out of game. <laughs> no, no, that that was actually. I'm not good. with you. I'm looking at my thing and I'm like, he said 100. I'm like, yeah, it's going to be gold. Yeah. If he had come back and <laughs> platinum. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah. No, it's not that high. So you want to go ahead and buy that? I do. Yeah. Too easy. Like Lenoris. No. Okay. Should be in there. No, it is not. It is now. Okay. Oh, there it is. Yep. And then uh, I'm gonna make my way back out to uh, to the cafeteria. Making my way downtown. <laughs> Walking fast, faces. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, yeah. Uh, as I walk, do I see uh, do I see Holmes just staring at the ceiling? Yes. Uh, all right. Um, that's weird. Do do I do I know why he's staring at the ceiling like that? Um, this is Damien with a shitty grin on his Go face. ahead, roll Damien's Arcana. <laughs> Damien's fucking god. <laughs> Damien bounced. <laughs> I'm gonna go sit over by. No, nope, you oh. got no idea. <laughs> no clue. You decide that he's looking up, going look, like this, look, 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 and he comes over his head. Lenore starts looking up. Yeah, I'm gonna start. Did someone write <laughs> gullible on the ceiling or something? Or I, I'm gonna look at Lenoris and be like, well, uh, considering that... struck again. <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, he does this from time to time. <laughs> I don't, you know, I don't know the reason, but I don't blame him. And I'm going to make my way to, the, I'm going to break my way to our, our table. And be like, oh, just going boy. up to Damien, like, what happened? Damien's not fucking there. He, he, oh, that's right. he, he literally he ate and then ran off. Yeah, he's in the, bar he's in the Barthel. He's in the Barthel. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so what are you doing uh, in there, Damien? <laughs> But I keep a glass of your most tolerable swill for my rank. <laughs> <laughs> he basically puts up an like a, a regular looking ale. <laughs> oh my god, it's normal. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna do the thing where like you're sitting at a bar, you're facing it, and he just like grabs a drink and he turns around, so his back's to the bar, and now he's just kind of surveying the room. People watching. Well, you, there's plenty of people to watch. <laughs> Is he doing the Doc Brown just holding his drink? <laughs> no, he's, he's sipping it. Sipping. He's doing better now. <laughs> <laughs> he's practicing up. It's been a month since his first drink. Yeah, and right. and two and a half weeks. <laughs> yeah, we're not drinking Lent. Uh, uh, um, Paint that uh, Tenarius's place. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Which has been renamed to uh, Tenarius's Temptation. Oh, oh, I, would not drink, I did not drink from there last week. I was like, I will eat your food, but I will not drink. It was like 99% alcohol. Uh, alcohol. Yeah. It's just <laughs> turpentine. Did, did you try the buffalo wings? <laughs> the food was good. No, yep. But no, anyway, come on. Just gonna okay, hear so, some people watch. Are you gonna talk to anybody or just stay at the bar? I'm, if if he's approached, he'll talk. But at the moment, he's just observing uh, clientele and pay, like workers and trying to see like the hubbub is. Like, wow, Lenaris really seems to like it here. 
Oh, here we go. Wasn't I doing that before you made me stare at the ceiling? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're still <laughs> staring at the ceiling. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. But like after a while, um, there will probably be a uh, there will be a female that will walk up to you. And she'll sit at My the bar badge. with you. She's like, uh, do you need anything? I'm not sure. You're a dick. <laughs> Lenoris is at, in the cafeteria like, I sense a disturbance in the force. Where is Damien? <laughs> and I'm going to start making my I'm going to start making my way to the Barthel. <laughs> Again. But like, she's being cordial. Like she's being cordial with you, not forcing you. She's like, well, we have uh, plenty of things that you can do here. Uh, besides sit at the bar alone and drink. If you, uh, I mean, you want gonna... some company for the night, I could take you upstairs. But why can't we drink at the bar? Well, this is a little bit uh, more than, you know, just drinking. Ah, so like cards? <laughs> 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 She's going to look at you. Like, I'm going to roll this. <laughs> oh, shit. Here we I'm go. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to get the glare out of the way. I, I'm trying to get the insight. <laughs> 10 plus 12. Yeah, she does not realize that you're gay. <laughs> and she's going to put her hand like, like on your shoulder. Be like, well, you know, uh, you know, private time. Just uh, you and me without any clothes on. So, like, yoga? <laughs> Just refusing to accept this. <laughs> Just complete. Complete. She's going to look at you again. <laughs> and roll insight. With advantage. <laughs> <laughs> like, is it really that like Damien like just the like the way he flies or the fact that he's just such an ignoramus when it comes to like the opposite sex yeah it's the social cues yes <laughs> the social cues <laughs> so she's gonna take a look at you and be like uh, so this is your first time in the uh, brothel isn't it uh t technically no well yes uh, well, I've been here for the alcohol before. My first time talking to uh, a courtesan such as herself. She's like, so when I tell you that we could spend some private time uh, without our clothes on, it does nothing for you. Uh, well, I, I haven't had private time with anyone without clothes on before, to be perfectly honest with you. So... I don't know what it would do for me. Good answer. Would you prefer someone else? I don't know, question mark. <laughs> <laughs> actually says question mark just to, yeah. like, drive the point home. <laughs> She's like, well, if you need anyone, may, uh, just go ahead and get up and talk to them. Like, uh, He's going to look around the room. What does Damien see? Um, the same thing that everybody's seen every single time. You'll have a multiple of, like, granted, none of these uh, workers are, like, overly attractive. But, you know, you'll find a multiple. So no Joe Manganiello, like, hanging out? What's that? <laughs> so no, like, Joe Manganiello, like, hanging out? <laughs> but uh, you'll see, like, a wide array of different um, males, females, uh, mostly humanoids of different races, and some, uh, but you will find some non humanoids. Well, what about that gelatinous cube in the corner? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. That really sucks. I'm just saying. <laughs> Been there, done that. It's all I right. See, I see you have a jar with an ochre jelly in it. <laughs> you got what? the one guy looking you, like you, you have Shore. a cage of flumps. <laughs> Fl uh, a flump. A flump. Uh, I, just like, I, think, I just like saying flump. Yeah, one like of the them, deep and hero gasm. Uh, yes. For example, <laughs> like, uh, one of them is a uh, water elemental. That's cool. Yep. That is. Uh, like, that is outrageously fascinating and androgynous. 
androgynous. And hydrating. Very hydrating. Very moist. <laughs> very um, moist. No, uh, I do appreciate the conversation. If you'd like to sit here and trigger me, you absolutely may. Uh, I am simply pondering, as it were, as I... He thinks for a minute. Would you let me know when an hour has passed? She's, uh, she'll be like, oh, we can definitely do that for you, if that's all you want. Okay. For now. And then, uh, uh, what's his name? He's going to point to, like, one of the better-looking individuals. Um, she's going to be... That is Bob. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever they make up Paulson. for. Uh, <laughs> Kelly Bob. She's, uh, <clears throat> she's going to look over and be like, uh, I don't know him well. He just started working here about a week or two ago. Um, but I do believe he said that his uh, name was uh, T- uh, Timothy. Charlotte? <laughs> hmm? Sh- Timothy Charlotte. <laughs> uh, like, I don't know his last uh, name. I just know. Uh, 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 that doesn't, doesn't matter. Timothy. Hmm. Uh, probably not important enough worth remembering. Uh, <laughs> wonderful. Uh, excellent. Uh, thank you very much. I will, if I work up the courage to go to talk to one uh, Tim, I shall. In the meantime, if you'd like to, if I could buy you a free drink and you want to hang out, be my guest. <laughs> she'll like the, like the drinks in here are free anyway. So she'll grab a drink and she'll just sit there. Yes. She's Maybe pretty sure that uh, she's shit. pretty sure that you have very little to no interest in her. It's he has very little to no interest in most people. Here. But he's just looking for like conversation where kind of like the same reason I'll go wandering into like a strip club or something like that. It's like <laughs> you're gonna come to me to fucking talk. You're gonna find me interesting no matter what the fuck I say. Because you have ulterior motives. Yeah. But <laughs> um <coughs> They do? Mm. What, are the, uh, what are the rest of you guys doing besides day uh Holmes is looking at the ceiling? I'm making my way. I'm still making my way to the bra, the 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 Barthel. Okay. <laughs> oh, what about uh, Marnin and Ren? I'm I actually gonna go grab to a shower. I to Marnin. Oh. Is you all just leaving me there, staring at the ceiling. You guys <laughs> fucking suck. There isn't anything I can do for you. I yeah, tried to see what was going on, and I have no idea. People that can do all sorts of shit. They can go. No, no more. <laughs> <laughs> I am not one of those people. Oh man, yeah. am I gonna have a talk with Aqua when I'm done with the sailing? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna go over to Marnin and say, "What's going on with Holmes?" Uh, uh, Damien, Damien struck again. Hmm. I don't know what that means. Duh, he. My friend, he's innocent. No, he <laughs> told him to stare at the ceiling for the next nine hours. And, Nine uh, hours? That's what he's doing. He's staring at the ceiling. Because, mm. yeah. Uh, I, I think that's so only last like eight hours. Like that? I don't know. It's Damien. Damien does whatever Damien wants. Apparently, I'm okay with that now because he's in a beef with me. At this moment, he's got a beef with Holmes. And... <laughs> Sorry, Holmes! For no reason whatsoever. <laughs> Somebody threw the first punch. I'm going to say... <laughs> It was not. It was not this guy. Along so why with... can't you do something about this? I don't you... know how to do anything about that. But can I roll? Actually, is there anything I can do? Uh, go ahead, roll Arcana. Uh, okay. Holmes gave him a little bit of lip. That's why he did it. It wasn't bad, <laughs> but he, hey, Damien was just it wasn't bad at all. It wasn't. That's what makes this worse. Don't drink I... more than a thimble size of, uh, of alcohol, or else we'll be peeling up the floor again. Yeah. Um, wow, 13. You're you skinny, have you're lesser restoration, and you're like, if anything would work, this would be it. All right, let's, let's see if that works. 
I gotta find out where. Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, how do I? Cast you just it? cast it. It's not that big of a okay. deal. All right. Um, yeah, down in actions next yeah. to Urza's saga. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. Um. Actually, it doesn't work. It doesn't. Mm. <laughs> but I would say with that, you know that if you that if somebody that is on Damien's side hurts Holmes, that that will work. So basically, yeah, you're like, you got to punch him in the face. I was like, should I smack him in the back? You know, like when you're a kid and they say, if you keep on making that face and I smack you, you're going to stay that way. This, this, this is all I'm doing right now. But you're like, I, you since know, that didn't work, my... you could, like, you know that you could hit him. I, I yeah, him? that didn't work. Like, so, I mean, you can hit him can gently. Him? Don't hurt Holmes, please. Uh, yeah. Holmes, are you going to try to not get hit? <laughs> no, I can't do anything. I'm staring at the ceiling. He's staring at the ceiling. Okay, so Heather, go ahead. Uh, Ren, I have go ahead. Roll damage <laughs> onto Holmes. Uh, 1d4 <laughs> plus your strength modifier. Oh, Jesus. So, you know, Christ. a normal fist. <laughs> He's going to go flying across the cafeteria. Oh, okay. So, so, so like 20 those. damage. So, just do your fist, and, and then I'll figure it out from there. The what, uh, is he's yeah, I needed your strength on top of that. Head around. All right, yeah. <laughs> Which, that's five. Oh, that's great. So that's seven. Seven. Yeah, you take seven, uh, Holmes, you take seven damage. Oof, just from a smack. Uh, okay. <laughs> now, really you good no, smack. now you don't, uh, no longer need to look at the ceiling. Hey. Next hey, time, Blake. don't uh, talk about my penis that I don't have. Uh, that, hey, that was out of game. <laughs> she full will smith you <laughs> um, with a twisted me. My mouth. <laughs> at, 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 at this point I, I get up and I go to my respective room I don't say anything to anybody mm -hmm. so you will find out that um, when you go back there uh, you're not in the same area as everybody else you have your own room huh because you're never here. So you got your own. You got your own room. Uh, I. By yeah. yeah. <laughs> don't want to be. Because uh, this is the first time you've actually spent any time sleeping here. Oh, oh yeah. Dr. Smile, friend. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. No, so I. 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 Uh, I. No, I. I do. I leave. I go to my room. I uh, close and lock the door. And uh, I go to bed. Wait, so of course, uh, you get there and you see that Damien sitting at the bar, uh, and there's a uh, an, like an okay female sitting there talking to him. Uh, hold on. <laughs> How okay? <laughs> oh yeah, no, she's not that okay. She's not that okay. <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna make my way over to Damien and be like, "What brings you to my land of degenerates?" Your land of degenerates. Oh, these are my degenerates. <laughs> I'm simply admiring the the atmosphere. I don't know. I'm bored. Ah. <laughs> Can I get you a drink? I already have one. Ah, cool. Barkeep, two drinks. One for me, one for him. He'll gladly put up uh, the drinks. How's Holmes doing, by the way? Has he blinked yet? I, I don't... I don't know. I He was staring at a ceiling, and Marnin said you, you, you did a thing to him. I, I merely suggested it would be fun to stare at the ceiling for eight hours. I could have told him to eat until he throws up, but I didn't want to be me. I mean, funny. <laughs> but why? What? Why not? Oh no, I mean, good reasoning. Why not? But, but why? Oh, uh, he 
made a offhanded comment about me passing out with a thimble full of alcohol to pick my ass up off the ground, and while it was such a who cares, like, his words mean nothing to me, I still felt the need to set an example. <laughs> you, uh, you do like doing that from time to time, huh? I love it. Cheers. Cheers. Clink. Clink. <laughs> Down the hatch. Here's to setting the example every now and then, I guess. <laughs> People need to set up top, top cock on the block around here. So who, uh... who, who has ever said that? <laughs> I have, just now. <laughs> All right. You know what? With that reasoning, sure. So what's our next job? We have to go to the town. When? We do. We have to get to that town. But they uh, they don't like guild members, right? So we sneak in. We'll get there I know it's morning. been a month, but you guys know to talk to Winston. Oh, yeah. Because he has so a... Uh, uh, he has, like... He's a he distributor like a... for the uh, jelly wine. So he has so, a link. Yeah. Uh, so how about this? First thing in the morning, we'll go meet Winston, get into town. We won't be guild members. We'll be, I don't know, just adventurers, traveling fuckheads. I mean, I can I can definitely pull that off. Can you? Easily. I could just say I'm one of Holmes' entourage. <laughs> Actually, it, the jokes aside, that would be a, a rather fitting uh, disguise. He is after me, the most intelligent member of the group, and his investigative skills are um, quite good. I will not deny that. That is his area of expertise. He specializes in it. Uh, I'm more kind of this guy. He knows how to get dirt. So, yeah, maybe roll with that. I Actually, not, you know, I think you like you said, you, you kind of threw that out. You posed that as a as more of a joke, but actually, that could work. It would make sense. He's an investigator. We need yeah. to just be his, how do you say, party. We, we, we definitely could use him to get into the town. <sighs> well, he has other skills, too. He's a phenomenal archer, and he knows how to slink in the shadows. But if we put him in the front people won't think that about him. It's true. Yeah, yeah, so... I like the way you think sometimes. I do too. That's why I do it. <clears throat> Are you guys going to be doing I... anything else? No, Damien's going to drink at the bar and be boring. <laughs> I'm going to keep drinking at the bar with Damien until I'm, until I'm drunk. I think I'm going to head that way Consider to the brothel. <laughs> yep. Oh, okay, so you're going to go to the brothel, Ren? Mm -hmm. Soto! <laughs> yeah, we're done eating. We're going to head to the brothel. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, what do you guys do there when you get there? You'll see Lenoris and uh, Damien are at the bar just drinking. Yeah, go okay. sit down next to Lenoris. <laughs> Plotting and planning and giggling like schoolgirls. <laughs> I need a good drink. A good drink, please. You're not, you're not going to find that here. Uh, no offense. Kind of okay. Drink. Belly wine. So, what is the plan of attack when we leave here? Oh, right to business. Yeah. Wow. Well, did, did you even order a drink? Well, get a drink. Get the drink, yeah. But First I mean, Holmes. I smacked him. He took off. I thought he was in here with you guys. You smacked him? Yeah, Jeez. he was staring like a dummy up at the ceiling. And, so I and, he, and he lived. <laughs> yeah, maybe she ran, smacked him. Was it was it open hand or like backhand or? I, I should have rethought that. Like I did open hand. Like you yeah. should have done the oh. baby powder on there first. Oh, you did that. Yeah, he's probably concussed. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah, you went full oh, pimp smack. Yeah. Lord, keep my pimp head strong. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So, yeah. Oh, no, Cheers no, to Ren's uh, pimp slap. Is, Salute. Hey. <laughs> is, is he all right? 
uh, I... he walked away, so I'm assuming yeah. he's okay. <laughs> Usually, if they're not okay, they don't walk away from me. No, well, that's that's factual. Yeah. <laughs> they're, yeah, on the ground, looking, they're on the ground looking at the ceiling. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Their eyes roll back. <laughs> Definitely a light concussion. <laughs> I'm going to go check on him in a little bit, but I'm going to finish my drink because we've been just doing all kinds of stuff. And I, just, I guess, talk about what we're doing, but I'm going to drink while you guys are talking. Definitely. Cheers. But, uh, we were just talking about uh, maybe going to that city tomorrow. Should probably do that. Well, uh, Damien's got a good idea of how to how to get there. Yeah, they're not a fan well, of guild members, are they? Well, we're not going to be guild members. Uh, if anything, we're going to be part of Holmes' entourage. Holmes. Oh, why not? I mean, it's Go not on. a bad idea. Well. After me, he is the smartest member in this group, and he is a phenomenal investigator, so we could set him up as a reporter, or he could be a PI, or what have you, and he can create whatever excuse he has to be in this town, and we'll be his colleagues, or understudies, whatever you wish. Mm. It would make really? sense, you have your security, you have your, your basically face, or voice, or PR person, it's going to Lenaris. Um, not still not quite sure what you do. He's pointing at Martin, and obviously, yeah, the scholar. <laughs> it all seems legit. Yeah. You are getting better, though, Martin. <clears throat> I will give you that. Now I'm only slightly concerned you'll get me killed instead of mostly. <laughs> he heals. Hey, hey, he heals people sometimes. That's I, not my concern. <laughs> I did great on the, uh, the 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 burial rites. Oh, you did so good. Yeah. Yes, putting people in the ground that are already dead. Phenomenal. Right. Am I believable enough? To another <laughs> drink because I don't feel like I'm believable enough. <laughs> he, said the, he said the Amadeus Deus type stuff. You know, he, yeah, he did exactly. the. Yeah, he's good. He's kind of. <laughs> They went hunting and they died. <laughs> the end. <laughs> the end. Show sure, us like a net one. Well, nice. Please beautiful. Let... That please was a beautiful don't... speech. <laughs> Thank don't you. let him talk at my funeral, please. <laughs> if he he won't live alive. to see it. <laughs> I was gonna say if he's still alive. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say you think you think you're gonna die before him. Right. In every mission we go on, I half expect what are my new party members gonna be like. <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah, I should start thinking that way. Anyway, so tomorrow I finish this drink and then <laughs> we'll reconvene in the morning. I that's a good idea. I'm gonna go awkwardly <laughs> looking. What's that? I'm just, you got something good? I'm, just, I'm just thinking about the conversation between Lenoris and Ren. <laughs> hey Ren, you drunk? Hold on a sec. Nope, you're still ugly. <laughs> if you don't look like your picture, I'm gonna drink until you do. Yep. <laughs> Hold on, let me get these glasses on. Yeah, nope, still not. <laughs> so is that what you guys are just gonna be basically hanging out at the bar for the rest of the night? Yeah, just yeah, more or less. Okay. Yeah. So, um, you guys will go to bed, and we will talk about Hello Fresh, who is a sponsor of this stream. <laughs> Yay! And then we'll go Hello on break. Fresh. <laughs> Hooray! So yes, we are going to be sponsored for HelloFresh for the next three day or uh, three weeks. Three days. Um, wow. Use the code down in the description below to get sixty five percent off. Uh, I did get my uh, HelloFresh from our last one. I've really been enjoying it. Uh, HelloFresh um, is fantastic. Um, you get to choose out uh, the meals that you want. And with this new code that we have, this is more for uh, families and stuff like that. Now, this does not mean that it takes long to make. Literally, it will take 30 minutes or less with every single thing. Everything is already uh, pre-cut and pre-put together. So it will reduce the amount of uh, waste that you actually do have. You get to choose your meals and even choose your own type of recipes. 
If you are on keto or anything to that extent, they can easily change that over for you. So easy, so nice. It works out fantastic. And honestly, it tastes pretty good. And if there is ever a meal, and this is something I want to stress, if there is ever a meal you don't like, you don't have to order it again because you get to choose what meals you have. You also get the, uh, uh, the choice to stop and start anytime that you want. Never have to go in. This is all 100% sustainable. This will help you get to your goals. Uh, if you're trying to do weight loss, become vegetarian, or uh, more of a fit and wholesome meals, this will be great for you. But yes, use the code, if I can find it here, uh, use code POGHF6007 for 60 five percent off plus free shipping on your first box at uh the uh was it streams.net hello fresh underscore pipe dream gaming underscore social and this will allow you to get a lot of free f uh, food for very very cheap anyway uh that'll be Go ahead, get HelloFresh and help support the channel. We'll go ahead, get on break, and uh, we'll be back here in about five to ten minutes. Yeah. But we'll go ahead, get uh, back in the game. You guys will wake up in the morning. Oh, um, you'll notice that there is not an extra room for Holmes in your guys' little abode because he has his own room. Hmm. Oh, he's all hoity. All hoity toity. <laughs> Oh, he was my dry martini. <laughs> but yeah, you guys get out there for basically breakfast, and it's up to you guys. Go ahead. I'm All gonna right. see if they have any small sausages, and fill my tray up with the rest of the breakfast. Okay. I am still. That's yeah, not bad, Porton. I'll take them. I'm going into the cafeteria also to get some food. Feeling a little bit. Uh, I wouldn't say hungover because you know, I can drink a lot probably, but. Grabbing some yep. food and chilling out. And they do have the little sausages today. Sweet. Oh. Do they have like the breakfast corn dog where it's the sausage wrapped in pancake? No. Oh. Damn you it. guys are too low rank for that. That is too good. Pigs in a blanket. It's like Damien's penis, only bigger. Like the breakfast is very, very basic because you guys are basically the lowest rank. Yeah. They, they right, got the lowest sauce, tier, though, right? They, they do have hot sauce, though, right? They probably would only have salt and pepper. Uh, you don't even get Tabasco. <laughs> you need to really rank up. You get the hot <laughs> sauce in the packages, the and tear open like ketchup. Listen, the MREs used a couple little battles yeah. of like Tabasco. <laughs> then they lost the contract. But anyway, what do well. you guys do when you guys get out? Uh, uh, grab my tray and go sit down. You should go talk to Martin. <laughs> <laughs> Carefully, you might steal the stair to ceiling. <laughs> no, I just oh, said you're gonna walk till you hit the ocean. Yeah, that too. Without uh, your shoes on. Right. Hey, Holmes, you, uh, you okay? I'm out there. I'm in my room. Oh. Wow. He's hiding. You scurred. I'm, uh, I'm gonna go grab my uh, my eggs. Realize there's no hot sauce, and use uh, my prestidigitation. To uh, <laughs> add flavor to it uh, of hot sauce. Nice. <laughs> and Holmes, you would be up. You'd be like, wow, this is what it feels like to be in a bed. And then you just kind of like, <laughs> like, even though it's a straw bed, it's the first bed that you've slept in for who, like, who knows how many years? It, months or years, yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> you're floating under nothingness. <laughs> I, I'm just enjoy, I'm enjoying the bed. It's like it's nice. It's like oh man, this is nice. Like this. I'm gonna tap tap Lenoris and be like, hey, hook me up with some of that. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> just cast Please. it on hers. Yeah, I'm gonna slide yeah. one of the little sausages over to Lenoris's tray and be like, go ahead. <laughs> what do you want? You want maple syrup flavor? What do you want? You want hot sauce? No, do the thing with the thing with the. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Is yeah. uh is Zinzanan around? 
I got a uh, ton he's normally more. not here for your guys' breakfast. He knows what's going on. So I'm looking around. Yeah, I can't, man. I'm sorry. Damn it. So I'd I like got to, all but... of these for nothing? I mean, there's a little, there's a little holes in your sh there's a little holes in your shoulder going. <laughs> <laughs> there's but a you guys... in the other shoulder going. Do it. Do it. You guys would Do notice it. that the uh, Parsons are there for the first time since okay. you guys started. Oh, yeah. Look at the Parsons are here. Yeah, and they're in their normal in garb, <laughs> black robes and masks. Parsons, Parsons, we got Parsons here. <laughs> See, nobody cares. Um. <laughs> oh, nice callback, they Rudy. They can't sit with us. <laughs> Anybody seen Holmes? Uh, the, oh. I'm enjoying my bed. I, just, I, don't, I don't have the luxury of laying down. He, he's still in his hammock. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Grape smugglers. Hmm. <laughs> Are uh, the Parsons, are they talking about anything, or are they just sitting there silently? They just look like they're, like, because like, their masks have, like, their half masks, so they've taken that, like, off their lower mask, so that way they can eat. They're just eating. Uh, go ahead, roll perception. Oh, it'd be good if I was here, huh, guys? That sucks, Damien. <laughs> not really, I don't care. You can't I tell if they're like, talking or not. I am rolling so bad today. Can I hear anything? <laughs> They're not saying anything. Damn. <laughs> that was a good roll, too. I want to point out, I rolled a six, and I think that's... Uh, no, seven was my highest, but that was a D100. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight, the part of Damien will be played by Lenoris. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Anyway, uh, what do you guys do? Like, Eventually, Holmes will come out of his room. Yeah. yeah. Gonna finish no, I'll, 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 I'll come out. I'll, I'll go get some. But I go sit with Kath. <laughs> uh, Kath oh, is wow. sitting with uh, Mike and er Earther. Er er Earther, because I can't say names. Say Earth. <laughs> yeah. Earth. Uh, Earther. So you sit down there, <laughs> and like the lizard folk with the monocle without glass, <laughs> and the other guy, uh, like I said. He's a half orc. He wears basically no, like basically no clothes. He basically just has a loin cloth on. It's a butt okay. flap. He's a yeah. barbarian. And they, yep. uh, you sit down with them, and they kind of look at you, and be like, uh, "Mike's like, uh, the half orc would be like, yeah, yeah, yeah uh, can uh, can we help you? I mean, you want to spar? Do you want to? Let's go." I tell him, "If I listen, dude, if I want any shit from you, I squeeze your fucking head. Shut up and eat." <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Them's fighting words. Is that like, uh, anytime you want to go and get some training, and I'm ready. Put me in, coach. Put me in. Cat, take care of my light work. Cat <laughs> doesn't do anything. You will see that he does have a new belt. Damn it! What the game that? <laughs> no, I just I just continue to eat. I, I don't say no. anything. Yeah. I uh elbow Lenoris and go, hey, <laughs> Holmes has finally uh made an appearance. Yeah, Good, why? He's alive. Holmes, Holmes is hungry. Why why is he sitting over there? I don't know. When I smacked him, he probably has, has a beef with me now. No. That's out of game, and I am in a game. No, I'm not mad at yes. He is. Go talk to him. He's such a prima donna. <laughs> <laughs> Did I go talk to him because I smacked him, or do you guys want to go do it? Uh, those guys, not it. I'm look. looking around the cafeteria, and then I is Gorp there. Look, he's just he's just being a prima yeah. donna. Like you smack like every him. everybody is here. I just get distracted for a second. You know, I can hear yeah. what you guys are talking about over there, right? <laughs> yeah, you're a prima donna. <laughs> we're, we're yeah, not hiding to hide it at all. Yeah, and you're not hiding. Look, look, look. You're a rock with lips. Shut the fuck up while I eat. Are you Enjoy the food. Anybody? <laughs> I'm good, Ren. All right, good. So we're if I were to throw 10, D, 10 D8 worth of damage at Holmes, do you think he would die? Yeah, of course I would. <laughs> You're not there. 
All right, so we're finishing up uh, eating and then going to head out, or? Yeah, that's the goal. We're going to link up with our dwarven, but is it a dwarven? I, I forget. Martin, Martin, Martin! Um, again, uh, it's been a month. Martin! Uh, Teneris said that, like, more or less, that he'd be uh, dropping you guys off at uh, Winston's place, which, yes, he is, he is a dwarf dwarf. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I was up on the I wasn't part of the conversation last night. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> exactly, because you haven't been uh, on an adventure. It's been like three days. Uh, no, I, I, I would spend an hour staring at a ceiling and spend the rest yeah. of the time going. Oh, Sorry oh. that was a little bit rough, but I had to get you out of it somehow. No, no, no. <laughs> I, I... Oh, wait. Right. Th this. Wait, do you guys. Did they tell me the plan? What's going on? To probably probably not because unless you guys want to catch him up you were kind of because you went to bed and then they went to talk about the mission now now me breakfast the cat that is fucking yeah exactly he doesn't want part of our group anymore so you know i suggest we just go talk to daenerys and uh he'll bring us to Winston, or and then we'll go from there so the plan i came up last night will alter it but it was a good plan like it all was. The, the things it was good to play. <coughs> I, yeah, we it, it, are we anti homes this week. We need <laughs> homes. Look, should we just should we just fill them in? Just yeah. stick with the plan. Let's fill them in. Well, that's that works. He's sitting next to him. We don't care. We do not care. Get over here. Y yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for the love of God, Damien gets up and he's like. I'm gonna say this once and once only. Shut up! You're really, you're vexing. You're you're vexing me. Uh huh. You're seriously <laughs> fucking vexing me. Uh huh. Once I, and I, once only. I, I go to rifle down a potato and it accidentally slips out of my hand and it goes towards D. <laughs> oh so, uh, upcasted level three chromatic orb using my natural twenty ten D A. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Go ahead, dude. You killed me. That's fine. You just, you just, you just, just. Did you just say ten D eight? Yeah. Yeah. Does an upcast at the five and a natural crit will turn into ten? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. I'm not right. that psycho. Like, God, we, I'm not going to waste we, a third level spell on a. What are you animal. talking about? You just wasted a nine. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Yo, what are you guys doing? Do uh, going to find Tanara so we can go to uh, Winston. Are you yep. guys gonna take Holmes with you? Come on, he Holmes. follows. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, so are you guys filling me in on what's going on? We're going to meet Tenarius. We'll let okay. you tag along. Oh, Damien can be up front. I'll stay in the back. But actually, that's the, the I know a fighter. Other <laughs> way around. I know, I know. I'm we're a supposed rogue. to be your entourage. Oh, oh, oh! Who's, oh, it, it sounds like something Damien would come up. What a stupid fucking plan. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's go. I feel like Damien's biting. Like, <laughs> have to watch over all of you as we can. He's biting his tongue so, now. I know. I know he is. Uh, you guys will like start walking out of the uh, guild to go over to Tenarius's place. It's uh, pretty early. Go ahead, roll perception. All of us. All of us? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Come on, higher than a seven. Yay, dirty 20. Oh, all right. S skills. 23. <clears throat> so you guys, anybody who got over uh, a 15 would right. see a uh, little cricket loading boxes into the store of crafts candies. What's up, little buddy? <laughs> <laughs> He's just gonna wave at you guys. <clears throat> that kid's killing it. Yeah, he's doing a good job. By the way, for those that weren't here last week, he successfully uh, pickpocketed somebody of the group. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> right. Got to go whole there gold. Time, there were times of charm. <laughs> well, it definitely six. wasn't me because I have no but... money whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, you guys get over to Tenarius. Uh, Tenarius is already like he knows that you guys are more or less coming. 
And he'll, like, in the lounge area, he's moved everything out of the way. And he's like, oh, we finally ready to, uh, we finally ready to go? Yep. Do yep. this. We're ready. Good. Hey, we wait till morning. <laughs> yeah, that's all good. I'm going to try to see if we can get as close as we can. <laughs> okay. He lands, uh, instead of using the teleportation circle, he's actually going to fu- uh, cast full on, uh, full on trans, uh, like, uh, transportation. Let me go check something real quick. It's a thing. <laughs> and poof. Um, we. Oh, sorry. Let's see here. Oh, okay. He's good. He's been here. Play, uh, he, he knows this place pretty good. And he uh, lands oh. you guys about 200 feet outside. Okay. Throws a percentile. You had a three. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Like actually, a uh, actually, it was a six. Oh, oh damn! Shit. Oh wow! <laughs> so you guys, uh, uh, but like I said, he he he's been here multiple multiple times, okay. so he knows the area very very well. Oh, thank you for that uh, speedy delivery service. <laughs> Won't you be my neighbor? <laughs> the only thing that uh, comes faster is Hello Fresh directly to your door. <laughs> <laughs> Keep plugging it. Exactly. Mm. Yeah. Um. But you guys get out there. I'm assuming you're gonna walk in. So with, with the with the so this entourage. Let me see if I understand this correctly. You guys are my security entourage. Is that what you mean by that? The way we saw it is they don't particularly like guild members. So keep all guild apparel hidden, and mm-hmm. you are an investigative sort of individual. You like to seek things out, kind of like I do, but less in the arcane nature. So do your thing. I'll follow you. I'll follow okay. your lead. So you're, you're my healer. You're my morale. You're my muscle. Mm-hmm. And you're my bitch. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, if that's because of how you pointed to that, the stream has you guys in different areas and what you think. Yep. He When he said bitch, oh. he was pointing at Rudy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Who are you pointing at? Because <laughs> so whatever for you whatever, is no one. <laughs> whatever I tell you to do, you better <laughs> fucking do it. You understand? For now. For now. But Just for don't now, forget, this, this is my idea. So don't oh, push your luck. I, I understand it's your idea. I'm just making it better. That's what I do. <clears throat> Listen, and he's gonna poke him in the stick, uh, the chest with the stick, <laughs> like just a hard jab right in the fucking sternum. And I go, oh, oh, oh that feels good. No, don't stop me tickling me. Listen. I'm gonna elbow the horse and go. It's the stick. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the, he's got the stick it's, out again. The stick is good. He's gonna disappear. <laughs> it's not the stick of banishing. Yes. <laughs> hey, listen. I'm just. Stick I'm just trying to make. Will you stick away? Keep your comments to yourself. Play along. Okay? I put my stick away the other night when I was at. Oh wait, you're not talking to me. I'm sorry. Yeah, this this, com- this conversation's yeah. over, and I turn around. Run, run's just like kid. And, 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 and I and I and I walk away. And I'm like, come on, come on. Go in. Let's talk to your daddy. Come on, kids. Chill out. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, you guys uh, walk in. Um, you'll see that um, Winston, he's uh, in the back. Like It's still fairly early in the morning. Probably like an like, there's only been an <clears throat> hour time difference. So it's an hour later than when you guys left. Mm-hmm. And you'll see him. He's uh, sitting there with this plant. And he's like, you know, watering it and being like, writing notes down and whatnot. Uh, You will see that he does have plenty, like he has several uh, bottles of uh, jelly wine on the uh, on the back of his uh, 
bar that he can hand out to special customers. And then after a while, he's going to be like, fuck. And he's going to continue to work on this plant. What's going on, Winston? What's up, Winston? What what happened to the plant? He's going to look and be like, oh, it's all of you. And he puts down his notebook, gets down off of his high, uh, high stool, runs up and gives Bran a big hug on her calf. Because that's about how tall he is. <laughs> it's so great oh, to see all of you. It's like, it's like Willow. <laughs> but of course, when he's saying this, he's only looking at Red. <laughs> all of me, not all of you. Yeah. He like, like literally, if Holmes, if you were up front, yeah, uh, he literally just bypassed you 100%. He's never seen <laughs> you before. No, no, like, hey, Winston, what's up? He's like, who the <laughs> fuck are you? And just runs off. <laughs> <Don't be. laughs> it's not even a who the fuck. He just ignores it and just runs yeah. right by. He completely he ignores by. it. <laughs> You're what's good, Dave. I understand. Out? No, it's all good. Some of us, so hey, listen. Some of us have thick skin here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but um, he's gonna like after he greets Ren and kind of shoes the rest of you off. Uh, he will look at uh, Lenoris and be like, "Yeah, this uh, this plant, it's uh, the jelly flower. For oh. some reason, it only grows uh, at that particular town." I can throw it up really? here real quick. Yeah. Zinda and my uh, business partner, he wants me to see if I can grow it someplace else. It's okay. like I had to put a rather large down deposit to okay. secure it. But yeah, my bus- uh, my business partner and I... Uh, He's a pretty shrewd man. So you have to figure out how to grow this plant here? Well, that was the uh, goal. I mean, he says, like, either way, the uh, contract for the distribution of this uh, of this wine. And he's like, uh, and he'll point at the bottles Um, like that's still a go. Luckily, with my uh, contacts and everything like that, it's been easy to find. Uh, retailers but yeah the uh, gentleman gives it for me to a discounted price I hand it out to everybody and uh, if I can get this dang flower to bloom outside of that town um, I'll get my deposit back hmm. do you know how to grow plants he's like he looks like you'd be like I mean it's like soil water sunlight uh, what else do you need that's what I thought too. But I, I have a black nitrates, thumb. pH, uh, maybe magical residuum, depending on location. <laughs> He's like, well, I tried to take some of the uh, the soil from that location and see if it'll grow in that outside of the location. It, it doesn't it. seem to be working. Mm-hmm. So it must be something in that location properly, like something yeah. in the atmosphere. It could be a humidity thing. You think of that. Maybe you're watering it too much. Maybe you're not watering it enough. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, if you want to check out the plant, you can roll a nature check. Yeah. Definitely yeah, I kind of. Can all of us look at it? Yeah. Ooh, 22. Oh, yeah. Na- nature check, you said? <clears throat> yeah. Which you still haven't picked, picked your extra skill for the day. Uh, my Mine was fully going to be um, athletics. I, I will not cheat the system. Athletics? I thought yeah. you already had it. Ooh. No, you had acrobatics. Damn. Okay. So, That's med- uh, that was Holmes. medicine. Holmes is still in that so one. Bad, he rolled medicine. Yeah. <laughs> so, Damien, from you was looking... Jealous. Like, you looking at this... You're like, it, like, you notice, like, you kind of get the idea of, like, granted, you haven't, none of you have seen this flower, but just with your basic 
uh, knowledge of nature, you could tell that there's like this seems like a very healthy flower. It's just not blooming. And he's doing everything that you can discern off of that with a nature check. Have you tried singing to the plant? Oxygen. So that's on my 22 gleaned. He, he looks at you and be like, he just looks at, uh, Winston looks at you and be like, well, normally when I sing, uh, things have a tendency of curling up and dying, or at least running out of the bar. <laughs> I never <laughs> never listen to you sing. But, it's only it's only a thousand gold deposit. It's not that big of a deal. It's like I got a contract and everything. Thousand. Hmm. Thousand gold. Not a big deal. It's only a thousand gold. I've basically made that back already. All right. Well, if you ever need some muscle to take care of any of this, just let me know. Not a problem. Uh, so what are you guys uh, over here for? You need to be smuggled into that town. <clears throat> Yeah. Hmm. yeah. Pretty much. They're not a fan of um <clears throat> and I <laughs> I, I, I kinda I kinda give sorry to interrupt you, Jordan. I kinda give Ren a little elbow to like <laughs> <laughs> He's like, well um Can I do for you Winston? My um <laughs> my son is uh supposed to go over there. They're having their uh big year allowing probably for the uh, starting of the town uh, coming up here in about a week and a half, uh, a week to a week and a half. The founding anniversary? <clears throat> yes. So basically think of uh, all the fun things in life that religious people aren't allowed to do and that is the place to do it at. Ah, oh, rump flinger. Flinger. <laughs> <laughs> like, you would think like you know, out of game. Think of Mardi Gras. That's what I thought. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought of yeah. Mardi Gras. Beans. He's like, okay, my you. son is uh, supposed to uh, set up, uh, set up uh, to our expansion over there. And uh, my business partner is supposed to s s send him, uh, go with him. We haven't uh, signed a contract for it, though. Yeah, so you Damien, guys could the, the, uh, the beads are to wear around your neck. <laughs> so if you guys what, want to go, carry you, just... if you guys uh, want to go with him, and you can yeah. be his quote-unquote bodyguards. I got this, guys. Sounds good. <laughs> you can come along too. But the um, gentleman you'll be meeting, his name is called a. Uh, he is uh, Mahadi. Mahadi. No, Hadi. Who's Hadi? He uh, has many, many titles, but if you don't know the entire, there's basically a week long track through the desert to get to this town. And uh, Mahadi is, has been nicknamed the uh, king of the desert. Hmm. He makes tracks across it all the time. So he's mm. basically the expert. Is there a mixed genie? Never mind. Uh, I don't know I'm... about a genie <laughs> or a djinn. Uh, he is rather powerful, though. Hmm. Basically, uh, saying, as long as you travel within, uh, <clears throat> you sh most likely won't even uh, come across anybody who wants to attack you. Hmm. Duly noted. So we mm -hmm. got to meet up with this guy. Good to know. Yeah, how do, how do we link up with him? Uh, we're actually about ready to go here uh, pretty soon. Okay. <clears throat> but as long as you guys all agree to uh, make sure my son stays safe and uh, stay safe. Oh, no. he, he, he's, a, he's a little young. He's like 16, 17. So oh. he, he's pretty young for his race. Gotcha. I just don't want to see him get into trouble. He's a pretty good cook and does. Uh, I've taught him everything that I can teach him about making ale. <coughs> okay. And of course, a few other things I've taught him. Like. But, oh, you know, got to teach him how to fight. 
I was gonna say, is he able to take care of himself, or do, you, do we have to watch out? For yeah, he still needs oh. to. Like he can, he, he does a decent job. Like he, he's not the strongest, but he he's still in train. We have a Ren for that. Yeah. <laughs> just assume he's helpless. It'll make things easy. We one hundred percent. We just have to walk over this kid, and we'll be fine. <laughs> not that he's or watch. Not not that he, we know that he's not helpless, Maris. Yep. However, however. We will do everything in our power to make sure that he's not hurt. If he is, oh, I'm more worried good. about him uh, not getting hurt by getting into trouble. Oh, uh -huh. okay. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. We got I, that. I, I, you see, I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. All right, yeah. Go ahead. That's it. That was going on the shit roll. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we'll, after you, you guys, know what? We'll, uh, we'll make sure he does not get in any trouble whatsoever. He's like, yep. Hey, uh, Junior, are promises. you packed? And you just hear this very deep voice coming from uh, upstairs. Yeah, Dad, I'm packed. <laughs> and uh, yeah. down comes walking a half orc. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And you can see this guy. Like he, he's he's pretty decked out. You will see that. Uh, he's wearing plate armor. Well, not plate armor. Um, breastplate. Okay. But the uh, breastplate um, looks kind of odd, and the fact that it, it it looks like it like has a foot in it, like there was part of a foot in it, and part of a hand in another spot. Okay. Um, he's also carrying um, a great axe, and. He has a weapon that most of you haven't seen before. He is carrying a uh, he is carrying a musket. Oh, blunderbuss? No, a musket. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So okay. blunderbuss is like a shotgun. This is an actual yeah. rifle. It's an actual rifle. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, that's so that's musket, best is flintlocks. Blunderbuss is just like a hole. That, that's but, pretty badass. Um, like you could definitely tell that he's about the same size as uh as like an elf and human, which makes him an adolescent for a yeah. half orc. For half orc. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> okay. Well I wasn't <clears throat> expecting that. No. no, no. <laughs> <laughs> but he'll start uh he'll start walking down and he's like, yes, uh that armor was uh, mine when I was in the military. We oh, okay. uh, melted it down and casted it for him. I've tried to gotcha. teach him everything I know. He does have some things to learn. Not as good as his old man. Well, and of course, I gave him a uh, little Betsy to keep him s safe from range attacks. He'll, uh, He'll be fine with us. We'll make sure he <laughs> we'll make sure he gets where he needs to go. Yep. He's yep. Like, I've already uh, like he'll like as long as you're able to get there, uh, we already have a spot lined up at the festival. But you just have to get there more or less. Gotcha. Too easy. All right. Well, then we should continue on. Yeah, let's go meet this guy and uh, make our trek through the desert so that way uh, no one's fucking with us. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I had to talk for a while. You're good. You're good. All right. Did you say Junior is your name? He's like, yeah, uh, I'm uh, Winston Junior. You can just call me Junior. Okay. All right, Junior. We named the dog Indiana. No funny stuff. I already have enough trying to keep these guys in line. He's like, I don't want no old woman. <laughs> oh. Whoa, whoa. Oh, well, wait. hell no. First and foremost, thank you for calling me a woman. I do appreciate that. Secondly, not interested in a child. I'm saying, just watch yourself. Is Ren gonna he, smash? <laughs> yeah, not he's going really no, no. like, no, no, to start I, no. uh, going for his uh, for uh, his great axe, and of course Winston's be like, "Son, 
Only as a last resort. <laughs> Fight your instincts. <laughs> I don't want you to die. Uh, it's good that you're giving him this top because if he reached the axe to use on Red, I guarantee you he'd be dead before he swung once. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So yeah, fight your instincts, Junior. <laughs> He's definitely looking, uh, he looks up to you mm -hmm. by a height standard. <laughs> But yeah, he's... Right. That's funny. Let's go. On gas kids. <laughs> exactly. Junior! Uh, <laughs> but you'll see that Junior has gotten ready a cart. Um, it kind of, like, by the outlooks of it, it kind of looks like a food cart. Like, has a uh, window on one side in the back. Okay. Oh, that's cool. But it is, uh, it is completely, it's not covered. It is hardwood all the way around but it does seem a little like platform. from the uh from what you guys can see it does seem a little small for an orc to or a half orc to walk in around gotcha mm. <coughs> right. so we gotta push this thing through the desert no no he has uh he has some mules oh gotcha okay he's like i, I yeah i got everything I got everything packed up. Got plenty of water. <clears throat> my food is of my own, though. You can't have any of that. Oh, we got so food covered, Junior. Yeah, we got food. So what you're saying is you're prepared, right? Yeah. Okay. Wait, you really well, think listen, you need to check it? Hey, bro, listen. You, you better prepare, simmer you, down. You, you, you need to prepare yourself <laughs> to listen to every single one of us. Shut your fucking mouth and do what we tell you to do. Mm -hmm. By the way, as soon as you say you need to listen to us, you just saw his eyes glaze over, and he started <laughs> turning around. Yeah. I like, <laughs> I like this kid. This kid's awesome. I think this guy's got a little bit of rage in him. <laughs> I can't wait to see this fucking thing come out. <laughs> this kid, this kid's dope. I told you, don't call me Junior. <laughs> Junior. <laughs> All right. But he'll uh, quickly like get up and like on the more or less the saddle. He's like, "Are we gonna go? Or are we gonna sit here and like lick each other, uh, lick each other's asses?" Mm -hmm. No. Nope. Like well, Damien would like that, but I think we should go. I didn't Let's talk go. to Winston for a minute. Hold it. Pause. I cannot Pause. guarantee. Wait, wait. Let's see where this goes. Oh, Pause. God. Who are you calling? You said I was thin skin. I've already forgotten about the altercation, and you've been nonstop about this for all day. So, last, last, no, shut up. Last come, chance. Come, come, come. Just shut up. up. <laughs> chup, chup, up. Zip, 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 Last chance. <laughs> Just quiet. Okay. Or, or what? Or what? You can, you're no. going to destroy you're going to destroy me where I stand. Hey, yeah, Damien. don't fuck Damien. around and find out. Okay, you ready to go? You ready? To and go? you're going to hear Winston just say, "Oh, for love's sakes, get a room. Let's go." Right? <laughs> That's what I say. Winston, I cannot promise you <laughs> that. What's the kid's name again? Back. Junior. Winston Junior. Winston Junior. Crush Holmes' head. I think mm. it's a great idea. <laughs> okay. So I die. And and he no. <laughs> that man has a lot of fucking thing and that would just be like With, the uh, you, best guys way to leave you guys are still there. You guys are still there, so I, you know, I, I am like, not still there. I am just being funny. I'm being in character. Uh, I am not taking I am not taking this to heart. I am be I'm in a position no, where anyway, I anyway uh, uh, Winston either. is there yes. and he's like son treat your uh, treat your teammates better, and they'll keep you alive. You. As he sees the infighting between us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody, let's get on this. Let's go. Right, so anybody else want to wanna kill each other, guy? or are we a team? Are we coming? Are we going? What are we doing? We're going. Okay. I don't. I don't want to kill anybody. I, I appreciate <laughs> you not wanting to kill anybody. Anybody else? I know it's rare for me. I know. I, 
Well, no, it's more rare for you to not want to screw anybody, but that's let's true. Just... <laughs> Where are we supposed to meet this guy in this town also here? True. Or... <clears throat> He's like, no, we got a couple days travel. All right, well, let's, let's get, get to on. it. Right. <clears throat> but uh, you guys will start off. Like this is a pretty like well, uh, well traveled road. <clears throat> um, like nothing really comes up and attacks you. You will see that like when you guys stop and go for a long rest, Winston will actually sleep in the uh, wagon. Which you will think, how can he get into the wagon and lay down? Because this thing looks super small. Like it looks like a broom, co- uh, clo- like basically two broom closets, but side by side. Can we that actually, yeah, that yeah. actually intrigues me. I want to see a contortionist or something. Go or, ahead, go ahead and investigate. Or, uh, or it's large. Actually, or it's you have to go it inside to investigate. So perception when he ever he opens up the door. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Perception. Gross. Okay. So yeah, Here's- it's uh bigger on the inside than it is on the outside. <laughs> Great. So it's a phone. Without booth. going inside, you wouldn't be able to tell how big this is, but you're pretty sure that this this place is big enough that all of you could probably sleep in there and not on the ground like you had like you did the night prior. Excuse me. It's what magical. gives? It's magical. Yeah. What's up? Why are oh, you? He's all, like, at, by the time you look, he like because it'll still be in the evening. He's like, what? I thought you guys like sleeping on the ground, and then he's just gonna walk. <laughs> He's just gonna walk back in and shut no. the door. What a dick! <laughs> That's funny though. <laughs> Ren? But yeah, if you guys open it up, you will see this place has a full kitchen. What? <laughs> like what? close, like, it's, oh, close so to, cool. like it's basically a gourmet kitchen. And you can oh, see that, shit. like while you guys have been eating field rations, he's been making meals. <laughs> I, oh, this well, is bullshit. I, I walk into this place and I just <laughs> set up my cot and Oh no, yeah, there's hammocks for all of you. We're walking. Oh, there's you know, six there's enough hammocks in here for all uh for all six of you. Hell yeah. I'm just like, no, fuck you. No. <laughs> <laughs> just out of principle. I'm sleeping outside. Who are you, buddy? <laughs> I'm eating I'm eating like dry cured meat. <laughs> I don't yeah. care. Fuck yeah, this. He's just gonna look game. at you guys while you have this like what the fuck he, fuck look on you he's like what you didn't ask and then he's gonna go to sleep. Were you supposed to tell us Winston? He's like, no. I, was I Winston? Was I supposed to tell you? I wasn't told to tell you. Oh Winston, you don't you don't look that dumb, buddy. Yeah, you're... he's just gonna get a big greasy like a big uh, uh-huh. grin on his face. And We're again, he's going to roll around alive. and go to bed. Winston, Winston, Damien's going to tap him. Winston, what? I suggest that you. I suggest you stay up all night. And he gets a nine. Oh, sorry, he gets an eight. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude, will you just stop fucking with people, man? <laughs> yeah, good man, Holmes. He kind of he deserved this one. He, he did this. I'm with Damien on this. He deserved it. <laughs> it was well played. Well played. <laughs> Horrible. But he will stay up all the night and suffer one point of exhaustion. Oh. <laughs> He's tooling around the inside like, hey, hey, from Moana. Buck, 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 buck. <laughs> when you guys like, when you guys wake what, up, what can I because say he spent the welcome. <laughs> because he spent the entire night awake. He's going to make food for himself. <laughs> I, I'm gonna go up behind him and go, hey bro, how'd you sleep? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, man. I had a steer in a fucking ceiling. <laughs> He's like, Don't know why my dad likes any of you. Uh, you look tired. Mutual. You should get some rest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, man. Did you not sleep okay last night? Uh, yeah. Like, he knows what happened. <laughs> <laughs> he just couldn't get out of it. No, the hey, you got any coffee in there? Oh, I mean, this luxury apartment that you have? Brent, did you sleep outside the entire night? Yeah, I did. 
<laughs> Fuck you guys. <laughs> yes, I did. Aww. He's like, why did you he sleep has outside? Like, two or three cups. Like, like he has two or three bowls of coffee, and he's like, "Yeah, I got coffee for me." No, I, I hate um, I, 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 whatever kind of cabinet he has, I just go and grab a bunch of shit and I bring it out the room. Hey, my food is mine, and he's gonna whatever, fall. Dude. <laughs> Joey, I, I, you want to go? That's for the store. Again? What's that? I, I, I run, I run, I run, I run with the food to us and toy to give it to him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, thank you. That was kind of. But, some people are nice. Um, let me see one thing. This one's on Junior. So while you run, you will see that he will take out. Uh, his great sword, and he's not doing any type of lethal damage, but he's or his uh, great axe. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Say, where are you at? Um, well, while he's, he's chasing take a Holmes, swing at you. While he's chasing Holmes, I'm gonna eat all his food. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna come over the doors and eat the food. For breakfast. Damien's gonna raid the cabinet too. <laughs> <laughs> he does miss on his first attack. Are you still running, Holmes? Oh, I'm goddamn right. I'm way faster than this guy. I'm running <laughs> as fast as I can. All right, Holmes. So, how I'm are you running from him? I am are running. Are you using your bonus action to dash? 100% no yeah. I'm dashing, dude. <laughs> and I close light him as uh, he goes underneath my arm and I'll just get him. <laughs> Didn't you go inside? This is outside. No, I'm outside. He's yeah, I'm, I'm um, running towards the outside door to, to, give, to give the food. Go to, ahead, to roll uh, athletics. Oh, uh, well, I'm glad no, I chose no, no, that no, one. Uh, Heather, because she's trying to oh. close line him. Uh, yeah. I'm going to oh, close line oh, okay. him as you go underneath. Oh, oh yes. yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, you Oh yeah. Oh wait a minute. That did not You barely beat him. Cause it should have been I accidentally hit Arcana. Oh no, actually, yeah, I hit the right one and he actually dodges like he hits your clothesline and just goes straight through the arm. Mm. What? <clears throat> like he like he's an He overpowered he's Ren's arm. Good god man. I keep running. <laughs> Not gonna rage. <laughs> yeah, if you rage, you probably beat him. And then he's gonna take uh, take out his gun, and he's gonna shoot at you and miss. <laughs> he's like, give me back my food. Stop eating, an asshole! Give me back your food. Meanwhile, me, <laughs> Lenoris, and Damien are eating food and drinking coffee. <laughs> We're just raiding, <laughs> raiding cabinets. <laughs> yeah, I'm just throwing it in my fucking backpack. Yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I don't even care. He after just a little, like after a little bit, he's starting to get tired, but he's gonna try to take out his net and catch you in it. <laughs> How can he catch up? I am so fucking fast, dude. Because yeah. these are ranged attacks. Uh, okay. Yeah. And All he right. does manage to get you with his net. Oh god damn it! It doesn't do any damage, but you're caught in his net. All right. I don't do. I, I don't. I don't even. I just sit there with the food in my arms and wait till he comes over. Oh, and there goes my hey, coffee. Dude, dude, can you take the fucking net off me and stop being an asshole? He's like, give me back my food. <laughs> he takes the food. But I, but I keep one link of sausage. I go, this one's going around. <laughs> it's like whatever. He All grabs right, the net and just pulls it off. He pulls it as fast as he can, just to see if he can get you to roll. Around in a circle. So go ahead. Oh God, never mind. Go ahead. Yep, try to yep. beat his. Uh, try to beat his twenty-seven. And that, go uh, acrobatics. Acrobatics. You have to beat a twenty-seven. Oh, that, that means a nineteen or twenty. All right. Yeah. Nope. Nope. <laughs> so he pulls his pulls this net, and you start rolling down the hill. Like rolling like into the ditch, and he like as you're rolling, he's just walking off. Okay. Oh, new day, new points. Let's play potato salad. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, wow. 
I'll take that. But at about done. this, like after a while, he's gonna walk in, see that you guys have all of his food. And at this point, he's just like, oh my gosh, we have to have some food for the uh, for the festival. My dad said I get to keep all the all the money that I make. Well, the thing is, uh, Junior, you fucked around and now you're finding out. (laughs) (laughs) You know what? He has a point of exhaustion. He shouldn't have been able to. uh... Well, (laughs) who cares? He he had a point of exhaustion. He should have been rolling at disadvantage. That's fine. Is there a big deal? Does he have the little sausages for breakfast? He he netted me. He netted me. (laughs) Oh, no, the attack was good. It was the okay. acro- uh, the athletics going trying to go through Ren's arm. Yeah, and oh. that I like, guess the checks. Mm. But yeah, you guys go in there. And he's like, I just hate it when, like, when you guys do this. I just my dad never treats uh, treats me nice. So he's and you didn't him. treat us very nice. You, I, I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> You didn't. You were uh, a right little shit to all of us, and now your comeuppance has come. Deal with it. Mm. Be an adult for once. Uh, but, uh, but, uh, but, what, are you, what are you, a child, Growly? Do you want to play this game again? <laughs> no. Do you do you want to do you want to wander aimlessly in the desert? No. Because I can I can give you a nice eight hour sunburn if you want. Fine. That's what I write. Apologize to Holmes. To Ren. Now, then come back here and apologize to us last. Go. Why do I have to apologize to Ren? Do it. Mm. And Holmes, right about this time, you're probably picking yourself up. He's going to shut the door. He's like, Holmes, I'm sorry that I caught you. Like you mean? <laughs> <laughs> sounded like you meant it. I, I like this. I, I like this guy. <laughs> I almost believe him. Like uh, Red, are you are you outside as well? I'm outside. <laughs> He's like, I don't know why I have to apologize to you. You're the one who tried to knock me over, but I'm sorry <laughs> that I am a little shit. <laughs> he's like he's 100 percent repeated himself it's like fucking himself. great <laughs> i am also sorry that you are a little shit and... <laughs> that doesn't make no Apo- sense apology <laughs> apology accepted <laughs> well, what and, I, and i give ren i give ren the links of sausage <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Next time you hold out on us about things, you're gonna find out a harder way than this. I accept your apology and stop being a little shit. And I'm shaking the sausage at him while I'm talking. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Then I'm <laughs> Do we see this engagement no, going on with Red the door. the sausage? No, he they're shut outside. the door so that way you guys wouldn't hear him apologize. <laughs> well, <laughs> you're not going to be a little shit anymore. <laughs> <laughs> but once he's like, once he's done uh, with those things, he's going to open oh up the God. door, walk in, be like, I'm sorry I'm a little shit to all of you. But I just want this to go well. It will, so stop worrying. We're here to help. Now that that's over. Do you have but anything you know, actually edible in here? Because this is fucking swell. <laughs> You'll see that the uh, quality of his ingredients on there are pretty good. Yeah, Damien's just being an asshole. Yeah. And oh. he's going to, like, he's going to look at you, kind of give, like, like, I can't do anything with this guy. And he's going to make you guys a really good breakfast. Nice. You could definitely tell that he has a natural knack for cooking food. Hmm. Oh, shoot. I'm coming in to the little, uh, small. 
So you're saying we have a cook. Okay. This is good. So, so we you like guys, scrambled since you eggs. Since or... like, are in there, you will notice that he's also been uh, distilling, uh, been uh, making, like he has several kegs of beer and he's making, like he's also in the middle of making some more while you guys nice. have been traveling. I like this guy. <laughs> he can just are very resourceful. Ooh. He's like, yeah, costs a lot, but I think it's going to work out well. All right. Gotcha. Uh, okay. Yeah. Well, I think, <laughs> I I think we should I think we should continue on here. Yeah, <laughs> we, we should. We, we, we have a long way to go. But let's let's also remember we did tell his dad that uh you know Winston that that we would make sure he made it where he needed to go. Yes. Yeah. So no, we never make... said he'd profit, we just said he'd get there. Yes. <sighs> so let's make yeah. sure we hold true to our promises. Yeah. Well, it we've was got another a... day's travel to meet this guy that's supposed to escort us to the desert, right? He's like, we're about a half a day away. All right. Okay. We're on time. What? Junior, breakfast is great. Why don't you, uh, why don't you go to sleep? Bro? <laughs> we'll, we'll, uh... Are you guys sure that you can, like, uh, you just have to follow the road. It's not that hard. As long uh, as you can handle the mules. Can, can I do a survival check? It would be handle animal. With, uh, uh, it's the DC is really, really low. I mean, it's like, have you ever ridden on a horse or donkey or use reins or turned one into a horse? With a nope, ball? I sure didn't. I mean, he is yeah. a donkey. <laughs> that that uh, was the third one. Third one I rolled the road. Hey, at least you're getting them out now. But yeah, both, yeah. Uh, both uh, Martin and Damien, they're like, yeah, we can handle this. Nice. Okay. Because it's just basically, right. you know, psh, driving him. I'm down. Yeah. I'm down to the hanging asses. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but he will I, I, take I, your guys' advice. <laughs> go to bed. Be like, just wake me up when you get there. You'll notice the caravan. It's pretty large. Okay. I would okay. suggest so to wake <laughs> me up before you talk to Mahadi. He's, uh, not a nice man. And then Neither he's going to go to bed. <laughs> That's fortuitous. Okay. We're not nice people. You are. And when you say that, he's like, you are nice compared to Mahati. Oh, Muffin. Thank you. Look, I, 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 look, I, have a little rest, right? I know he's tired already. Why don't you cast some sleep? Really go to sleep. Are you going to cast sleep on him before he gets there? <laughs> before nope. he gets to bed or are you nope. gonna let him get into bed are you kidding me if I if I had a spell called caffeine I would cast that on him <laughs> Damien does Wait. it's called don't you want to stay up and sit next to us quietly for the entire trip that's, that's funny. Like, I'd rather go to bed that's funny though <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm not doing that to him not fucking mean I mean I am but not cruel <laughs> But he's going to go yeah, to bed. You guys easily handle. Holmes tries to go up there and and uh, tries to get the asses to uh, mm -hmm. do something with. Anyway, like he goes over there and they just they like he goes over there. Okay, it's time to go. And they <laughs> sit down. <laughs> <laughs> it's not how any of that works. <laughs> 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 But you guys will get there basically after lunch. Is there anywhere that has like a mirror in there? In the back, um, there will like you will find something reflective. Okay, I'm gonna go and like check myself over because you know still worried about becoming a werebear. Yeah, you would know that if something was going to happen, like if it hasn't happened now. It's either A, going to happen during the first full moon, mm. or it's not going to happen. It's just a thing. Just the par paranoia. Yeah. But Still at this point in time, there's nothing it. new. 
you would put it though that uh the first full moon you will be in zin day four mm-hmm. fantastic were you bit by a werewolf i was I that was a long time ago a werebear a werebear i i i didn't know that it was Maybe a while you should watch ago. the episodes, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Dave. Yes, I yeah, was. Yeah, Dave. Sorry, I'm too busy mailing out Kevin or Souls and Marsh Flats. Because you would not know why <laughs> she's looking at herself in the mirror. And it she actually told you. <laughs> but you're so vain. <laughs> well, Basically. I mean, last, last like, If you want to roll had... insight to see if Holmes thinks that there's something up, you may. Okay, I will. With but, uh, like, Holmes to be fair, Oh, that was, uh, was, a, it was a Oh, 16. no, no, I need it from Holmes. Oh, sorry. Uh, insight? Oh, yeah. yeah. To be fair, I did stand in front of Mel last last time to that, check not myself dirty out. 20 dirty times. 20. Yeah. So, like, Ren, would you care if he noticed or not? Mm-mm. Yeah. I so you would notice that she's looking at herself, and she's worried about something to do with her looks. But you don't believe that she cares about her looks. It's something else. That's all you would know. Not, not, not her aesthetics, but something else. Yeah. yeah Whatever she's looking for is not as, uh, for the aesthetics. I, I, while you look in the mirror, I put a reassured hand on your shoulder. Uh, what, what, what are you doing? And just kind of just give the, you know, like the, that, like, you know, that just reassuring nothing weird. <laughs> and, 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 and I kind of walk away, like like really fast, walk away. <laughs> it's, it's... Weird. It's kind of drafty in here. <laughs> <laughs> and oh, like, page left. <laughs> I feel like when you have to say nothing weird, makes it weird. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't yeah, make this not, weird. Not not weird. Not weird. Just like like not, no offense, not, but... not creepy. You know. Anyway, when yeah. you guys. Uh... Like, is anybody going to do anything for the morning, or are you guys just going to go to the caravan? No, we're going to the caravan. We're going to okay. the caravan. So when you guys get to the caravan, you'll notice that this caravan is basically right on the edge of the desert. <clears throat> you will see um, that most of uh, the people, most of the uh, stuff in the caravan does have a uh, symbol on it. But it is a very odd symbol. Most of you have never seen it before. Or oh, none of you have actually seen it before. I Unless... That. Is anybody proficient in religion? Oh, is there anybody? <laughs> I almost... Sorry. I, I almost picked religion today. I don't know why, too. I, I actually am. So go ahead. <laughs> roll a religion check. I swear, Brian. You have no idea nope. what this thing is. I have a plus one in it. Yeah, and I, uh, this actually needs proficiency because it's very obscure. Mm-hmm. Mm, yeah, no. Yeah, and anybody, you have no anyone, idea where any, this symbol came can from. Be, can anyone beat a nat one? <laughs> I'm going to try. <laughs> no, no, Brian, if, Brian, if you're not, you, like, if you don't have proficiency in religion, there's no way for you to know what this is. Yeah. Because gotcha. this is something that is taught. Not even history at disadvantage? Oh. Oh. I just, I'm history. Because this probably advantage. would have shown up. Okay. And I'm only giving it to him because he's a sage. He's a book reader. Uh, 16. <clears throat> it was almost a turn. So. You like you'd be like, man. I know I've seen this symbol before. Like, what the fuck is that? Like, where's it from? <clears throat> I've seen mm-hmm. it in a book someplace. I cannot remember the book, but I know this symbol is not normally used on the material plane. Is it so? Obs- is the symbol so obscure? We all go, huh? Like, we, we, you guys, like, like, if you're not, if you don't have a proficiency, you're like, oh, it's just there's. You know, company stamp, stamp basically. Right. Yeah, you okay. pay no attention to it. I understand. Because Rudy is a sage, and this is <clears throat> this would have been in history books. <clears throat> and because it is a particular symbol that certain religions follow, yeah. that's why if you have religion, 
or history, there's a possibility that you picked it up. Now, would I know anything like that of being a, a past sailor of seeing something nope. like that? Gotcha. Okay. This has nothing to do with sailing. Okay. It's not of the sea. <laughs> it is of the dirt. It is of the desert. Now I got a jar of dirt. <clears throat> now I got a jar of dirt. <laughs> <clears throat> But uh, you guys will get there. This is, like I said, it's basically the edge between the forest and the desert. Basically grasslands, and they're all setting up. All right, we should all probably right, wake, wake up, up Junior. Two. I'll wake him up. Yeah, I guess we should wake him up. Uh, he'll wake up. He still hasn't gotten a full yeah. night's rest. So Lock he still up. has a point of exhaustion. But he's well on sure. his way. And he's like, oh, Okay. Let's go find Mahadi. Son of a bitch. You really don't like him. <clears throat> do any of you speak Celestial? Yes. I believe I believe I do, actually. No, uh, not here. Uh, so, Martin, you speak Celestial? Yep. Fluently, might I add. He's going to pull out a contract. I think He's like, I... Think I you too. Go and he's going to show it to you. Dave, and just Go look at the language. It'll have yep. all the ones you know come up. Wh which one? Skills? Uh, There's a little oh, there. up the the chat box. by the chat. Yeah. It's an easy but way I to can quickly check, uh, check for you. No, no, I, I do not. No. Alliance Epistle, Common, Elvish, Primordial. And, and Thieves Scan, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so he'll show you this contract, Marnin. And it seems okay. like a very legitimate contract a uh, very little uh minimal loopholes and stuff like this uh go ahead and uh roll me investigation all right i do love loopholes oh yeah 20 and red tape <laughs> your eyes are going to get very large the okay. deposit was not for a thousand gold it was for a thousand gold and winston's soul Okay. Someone got ripped off. That's not a loophole. That's a that's a check. And with that um, check, like you would know that there is no way to get out of this contract. Gotcha. Well, I'm gonna say out loud that sucks for Winston. What? He's like, what yeah, sucks? my dad signed it without, like. He asked a lawyer to take a look at it because my dad doesn't know how to speak celestial. Your dad was and calling. signed it at the lawyer's office. Yeah. Um, who was this through? Mahadi? Yeah. Mahadi and uh, one of the local lawyers. The lawyer looked over it. My dad signed it. Who's so. The lawyer? Um, it's somebody that you guys have never met. It's in like it's literally a guy in uh, Winston's town. Third so, party or Mahadi's lawyer? It was the uh, local lawyer. So the only person who can cancel this contract is Mahadi. Yeah, pretty much. Or if my dad, dad can get the plant to grow outside. Also, follow up question: Do we even care? Like, this has no impact on, like, what we're doing. He made a bad deal, so there's that. I like Double D. <laughs> a little bit. Well, I, I do, too, but, you know. I mean, it's pretty shitty. Yeah. Right, but we didn't... We're not responsible for this, and it's also but, not what we're here to do. But, but, I'm not looking at the... I'm not looking at the soul part of it. He gave him a thousand coin Winston gave Mahadi a thousand coin and his soul to be the sole uh, distributor of jelly wine so on the land a soul for a soul so how much money does this Mahami Mahadi have Damien Lenores I'm, I'm with Damien I don't, I don't think this is why we're here 
Yeah, also, uh, it's, something, really, it, it's only a thousand gold. That's nothing. Th from one person. So what? But someone that, that's that. A, someone that's influential could have tons of money. And well, a thousand dollars, uh, a thousand gold, and a soul. Hmm. As of right that now, most of you guys like Winston. But if you get rid of the Mahamani, you get to keep his money and save Winston. I'm just saying, it's something to think about. You don't have to do it. Take your time, sleep on it. Don't I let mean, it go to your head. We've got a bit bigger fish to fry right now. Just saying, sure. not but to like, sound all Damien about Junior's it. Junior's gonna look at you guys and be like. Look, we can't get out of the deal. We know we can't. Unless That's why it's so dies. important to figure out how this flower works. Mm. Mm. Okay. I'm not asking you to do anything. I'm just letting you know. Make sure you can read the contract if he makes you sign one. Hmm. Well, only an idiot would sign something without being able to read it. Yeah. Uh, or, I hate to agree with Damien, but... I agree with him. <laughs> yeah. I'm... That's why we had a lawyer that said that he could read Celestial. Yeah. Did he, re did he read it out loud to you, or did he just look it over and go, yep, sounds good? I wasn't there. Worst, worst lawyer ever. Yeah. <laughs> I call shenanigans the lawyer. All right. Well, there's nothing we can do for his soul right now. We just was, have to continue. Was the lawyer's it. name Dwight Schrute? <laughs> I believe it, uh, I believe his name was uh, Shut the fuck up Wow <laughs> oh, Wow He says that to okay. Lenora's oh, That's the deal Don't be a little shit <laughs> look, look. We'll just get you where I you need to I understand my dad was dumb uh, My dad was dumb for doing that it's not your mission to try to get his soul back. It's something that we have to do. If you can help, I'd be thankful. Hmm. We'll put it on the back burner. Right. Let that one simmer. So what does this dude look like? Just look for the most flamboyant person here. Oh, Mikati. <laughs> At about this time, you're going to see a uh, large, dark skin uh, man. <clears throat> Crap ton of gold. Like, think of like, like he basically has a uh, turban and robes on. <laughs> has oh, a ring for every good. single finger. <laughs> yeah, multiple, yeah. uh, mul like, just completely pimped out. And He'd he's be like, blinging. Ah, Junior, my friend. Junior's gonna my like. Uh... Oh, my eyeballs. Oh. <laughs> is uh, is that the guy? Yeah, <laughs> that's that's the asshole. That's that's Mahati. He's like, yes, I am Mahati. I, uh, we already have everything set up for him for the town. We just need to uh, make arrangements for the uh, travel there. What kind of arrangements? Well, you know, you're going to be traveling with us. If you uh, travel with us, you make sure that we get you there on time and uh, we'll make sure that you get there safely. Well, we even give you a uh, place, a place to stay uh, while you're in town. Not uh, better than uh, that little thing. At least. Okay. Well, what, Ma Mahadi, hey Ma, uh, can, I, can I call you Ma? Is Ma okay? It is Mahadi. Oh, okay. Hey, thanks, Ma. Hey, um, so where do you need us at? Well, first, we need to come to a business arrangement. This is, I am one of the only people that can get you there safely. And that mm -hmm. type of thing comes with a price. I'm sure oh. it does. What's your price? He's like, I think for travel and stay, uh, a thousand gold pieces. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nah. No. No, we'll Wait, offer you we'll, we'll offer you protection. And we'll do what you tell us to do. <laughs> uh, protection. <laughs> you don't understand. This symbol and he'll point at the symbol. Uh, this symbol is all the protection I will ever need. And what's the what's stopping us from just putting that symbol on our stuff if it's merely 
drawn on. <laughs> I would love to see the try. And putting the symbol on our stuff or protecting you? Oh, this. You, you do not need to put the symbol on as long as you transfer with the cargo, uh, with the uh, caravan. Uh, you'll be greatly protected by me and my fellows. So we just walk with your caravan and that's protected. So we don't need the gold. Cool. All right. That's what I want no. to know. That's not how it works, my friend. What is the symbol? You are either part of our caravan or a potential enemy of my caravan. You may walk across the, uh, uh, the desert if you wish, but I guarantee you, you'll have a much harder time. And you may not make it in time for uh, the festivities. Well, here's the deal. Um, we were told to that you would help arrange transportation across, but not for that price. We didn't hear anything about price, let alone a thousand. We don't have a thousand collectively between all of us. You guys do. You don't know that, but you guys actually do. Oh, oh I'm, to I'm totally bluffing. I, I have not. Go ahead, roll deception. I don't know if your character knew that or not. Go ahead, roll deception. I'm I, I am. I am. Okay. Well, I'll put it this way. I have a good idea that we do have it, but yeah. Sorry. But no. Yeah. Go ahead, roll deception. Okay. I'm gonna whisper to um, Lenoris. Hey, I think we can put that symbol on us. All of us. Oh, this is maybe this charisma. Oh no. He's like, look, I'm making sure that you have enough uh, money, not only for what's in your purse, uh, but also buy more supplies if you need it when you get that. I know for certain that uh, you have much more gold than a thousand. I pull up my pockets. I literally have no money. <laughs> oh, I'm not talking about just you. I'm talking about all of you. Mm, well, I always speak for myself. And by the way, a thousand gold is way too much. You know this. <laughs> yeah, it may be way too much for what you think, I... but have you ever traveled through the desert? It is very, I'm... very uh, harsh. All right. I... Can, I, can I get a read on this guy? Uh, if, like, maybe he's more than just, like, a merchant to, like, say, like, if he has a particular class, like, if he's a sorcerer, a warlock, you know, a fighter, just... Um, I'm going to go say him. roll Arcana. That's what I was just going to ask is if I can get a read Oh, no, if you guys guy. want to... Well, that, I, I don't know if it would be insight. Yeah, you can... Fuck, it was a 20, and then it's like, no, yeah, I want to be a that. 4. If you guys want... like, You can also roll insight. It's just... Like, you guys can roll insight to see like what's going on. That's bullshit. Natural. Okay. Holmes. Nat 20. Oh, Holmes got yeah. a nat 20. <laughs> you know this guy is really hard to read it's like he was but you would get a sense that he is <clears throat> that he is very confident in the fact that he could take uh, all uh, all six of you on by himself whatever he all has right. going on with him like you could yeah. definitely tell that this is no mere man he is something else. Okay. I keep that to myself right now. That oh. will be later, later discussed with them. But I, I, I shouldn't. Yeah. I don't. I keep it to myself. Hmm. It, hurt, like, like, it hurts. It hurts. Say, um, but. Can, 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 can I cut you off for a second? Yep. Can we? Uh, uh, Mad Mike, can we have a moment here to talk? amongst ourselves before we pull the trigger on anything of course we have plenty of time thank you I and you can tell it. that every single time you say his name wrong he's like kind of twitching mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> thanks bro <laughs> you can go <laughs> he'll go like he'll go off and he'll like he's starting to get the caravan ready getting people set up uh, one more. I uh, can I um, digest it, everybody. Let's get inside. Let's get inside mm -hmm. the mule cart. Close the door. 
Uh, this is a bad motherfucker. <laughs> what I'm doing right now is something we should not be doing at all. Uh, if we have the money, we may want to pony it up. This, this, you cannot bargain with this guy. But we I, need to get to this. We need to get to this desert. Thousand gold is a lot of gold. I understand. I, and you're speaking I, to somebody who doesn't. <laughs> When, like, when, uh, Junior's going to be like, why don't you try to negotiate? I mean, a thousand gold is a lot. It's not coming out of my pocket. It's coming out of your pocket. I have the personality of a dead moth. If anybody's going to negotiate, it's going to be Lenoris or I would assume Martin. Well, just <laughs> by the contract of a thousand gold versus a soul or with a soul. Um, we're no not con- signing any contracts. Well, no, we're not- no, con- no contracts. No, no, no. What, what, we are not signing a contract with this. Why guy. did you even jump to that? No, you're out of the conversation, Lenoris. Um, <laughs> trying to chew him down to like. I was about to, but I got cut off by somebody. Fix that post, Brian. What's that? Fix that post, Brian. <laughs> so you guys uh like basically come out uh Lenoris, you'll see that like uh, mahadi is standing on his carriage kind of like on the back steps <coughs> excuse me pointing out the back steps like basically directing people left and right and he's gonna uh, look at all of you and be like oh so have we decided so we've 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 come to a decision that a thousand gold is a lot of gold. Uh, yes, it is. Would you be willing to do it for less? He's like, well, there's always certain arrangements that we can do. Uh, what did you have in mind? I'm thinking uh, 500 gold. Uh, go ahead and roll persuasion. He gets a 19. Nineteen oh. plus what? He basically I mean, almost rolled a nineteen, so that's a twenty-nine. Nice. Ma- uh, Mahadi will s- sit back and be like, "Hmm, are you? I think we can work something out." So Sorry, I got a couple of options for you. Let me hear them out. Well, uh. If you do not know the town, it has a very large coliseum. And my uh, champions, uh, my sponsored team, um, isn't going to uh, be able to make it. So how about this? All you have to do is win one game. Mm. I, of course, will uh, choose what level. Mm -hmm. And... uh, as long as you're sponsored by me, uh, you'll take half of the profits. But one will be at one that I choose. <laughs> now, if that does not sound agreeable to you, uh, I also... Are you a man who likes chance? <laughs> oh, I... You know I am. <laughs> He's like, I, I have this deck here, and you will determine how many cards we pull <laughs> one through three. Son of a oh. gun! <laughs> God damn it! And <laughs> you know I have to. <laughs> Listen, Everlock is going. It's a trap. <laughs> <laughs> if, and once you choose, I will draw that many cards. And each one of the five of you will draw that many cards. Oh. This is not going to end well. <laughs> Go on. And now, to be fair, this is a very special deck. Some things are good, some things are bad, but I love the chats. Mm-hmm. A deck of many things. Yeah. It's a 100% a deck of many things. Yeah. yeah. There he is. Go ahead. Like I want. Like I know you guys know what it is, but anybody who wants to roll Arcana on this, go yes. ahead. And then your character yes. can act like, yes, that is the deck. 
Yeah. Oh, I 100% know what it is. That's yeah. Awesome. So everybody but so Ren Dave. knows what this uh, what this deck is. <laughs> Seems like this is familiar. Anybody know what this is? I'm gonna nonchalantly go. It's the deck of many things. What she doesn't even do know that what that is. What? what does that even mean? Ren, it's night. And that, uh... The deck of many twigs. What? It's it's not the greatest. It's it's volatile. So oh, I, I am anything to do with this. I'm going to confer with my uh, compatriots here and Lenaris, I'll say this right now. If you decide on this, the number is one. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> but it's that or basically the Coliseum, which also sounds fun. Yeah, Fight Club. it does actually sound pretty fun. I mean, are you guys I we all have to draw one card from the deck. Are you all Fuck this deck. as much as gambling as I am? No. No! No. <laughs> the only thing I know that I can gamble with is my, my I'm actually okay sword. with that. Wow. I'm no, sorry. We... Am I going to turn to, like, listen, I, I love the Coliseum. I'm okay with that. But this is an artifact. And it always seems to come back. I mean, we, we did put it to a vote. It's me and Damien, Ren, and, and Marnin, so it's at a tie. Oh, I'm a tiebreaker. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, you don't count. <clears throat> oh, well, who's the tiebreaker? It has to be Holmes. It's Mr. Holmes. Mr. Nibblesworth? Mrs. Nibblesworth, get it right. Whatever. <laughs> Sexist bastard. <laughs> Tiebreaker. Look, you're gonna get some really great boons, or you're gonna get some really horrible. Well, and we don't, and we don't know how many cards have been pulled before. Uh, I do know that uh, some of them, particularly in the void, not the greatest. However, I, for one, would not turn down an opportunity to borrow from such an artifact. It. The knowledge alone is just outstanding. I I agree with him, and by the time we get to the Coliseum, you'll probably blink out anyway, so it won't be your problem. I, when you put it in that perspective, yeah. I... Pull the fuck, pull the fuck. <sighs> Ren? Marnin? Yep. I guess we're pulling cards. And For Coliseum. fuck's sake, just do it. <laughs> All right, we're pulling cards. Oh. I have the physical deck in the next room. <laughs> Do me yes, a favor. Absolutely. That's awesome. Because apparently they give me a table for everything. Yes. Except for the deck of many things. Oh, perfect. Damn. So you can just give us good stuff. Do you no. want me to just shuffle it and like pull them? I for want you to shuffle it. No cards are removed. Okay, I'll be right back. He, he actually has a. He does have the deck of money. Yeah, oh, that's I'm not, fucking I, awesome. I'm not saying that he doesn't, but yeah. I, that's what I've been like looking over here. Is that I'm like, dang it, I like because it has like a table for everything except for the deck, which is very annoying. Probably because they're you like, get... no one should use this in a deck. Uh, no one would ever agree to this except us. All right, so. Like... Like if you guys so, want to wait uh, a little bit, I can get this. This is this is just nothing. Uh, make sure they're all there. Because we can wait Sorry. here for a little bit. Yep. Because I'm already on the thing. fates. Yeah, I don't want any removed. This could be either. Really okay. Good usually, find a box of pouch is decked in thirteen and twenty-two magical cards. Yep. So two are out, and they're basically like the fucking jokers in a. A regular deck of cards. Gotcha. So Jokers should you be. You know, one, one's the rules and one's the. Um, how do you say? Because they're uh, the fool and the jester are the jokers. Yeah, right. I know, but these right here, these two cards. That's why I held them up. Are kind of. Oops, gotta set the actual deck down right here. This is oh, one more on the ground. This is just saying, hey, this is what the deck of many things what it does, oh, okay. and this is like your rules and like. Yeah, okay, gotcha. You typically, that's why. So Anyways, go ahead. 
Uh, shuffle it up, and Mahadi will draw first. Mahadi will draw first. Oh, he's drawing too. No, no, that's the chance. Yeah, that was, yep, yep. We all draw. If he gets the void, I'll laugh my ass off. So go ahead and pull a card, show it to the camera. We'll see what he gets. Well, I did a couple of riffles, so now we're going to do some. I trust you. Well, yep. um, oh, I know, but I want to be that guy. All yeah, right. He's, he's one card. Yeah. I do not know what that he, card he, is. He got the star. The star. Immediately I think that's actually one of the good two. ones. Yeah. Immediately gain a plus two bonus to one ability score. The two points are added to any of the ability the character chooses. They cannot be divided among two. So he gets plus two to one ASI. Yep. He's like, ha ha. The, lu- uh, the luck of the draw. And he's going to put the card down. Okay. Who's next? Nora. You? I was going to say, I'm, I'm right up. So I'm next. Uh, Second card down. Uh, too late. Oh, shit. What do you get? You might be in a good. He got the comet. You must single-handedly defeat the next hostile monster or monsters encountered, or the benefit is lost. If successful, you gain enough XP to level up. Damn. Yeah. All Whoa. right. So you have to you beat are... somebody on. Well, you have to beat something by yourself in combat. Yep. So the next hostile thing that comes up, he has to solo it, whether yep. it's a group or a single. Well, yep. I'm not leveling up. My eyes are like, ah. Well, at least you have to work for it. Who's next? Fuck it, Damien. Let's see the void. Oh, crap. <laughs> What'd you get? I got the good one. Y'all are fucked. Don John. What's Don John? <laughs> You are imprisoned, either by the imprisonment spell or some powerful being. All gear and spells are stripped from the victim in either case. Draw no more cards. So you go to prison? Yep. Uh, is it the one that it's just the mind or is it's it not the... the vo- no, that, that's the void. Okay. Don so... John is like, you're either imprisoned or like some powerful being does this to you or the imprisonment spell. So what is going to happen is that you're going to get transported away. All right, where's me? <laughs> when you, uh, after, and you guys will see him disappear. This is and, this is your fault. Friends piss. <laughs> and uh, he's like, uh, and uh, Mahadi will look, be like, uh, look at the card and be like, don't worry, I'm sure he is in very very good hands mm, and he's going to put the cart down to the side <clears throat> and uh, Damien when you wake up you find yourself in a prison on a different plane of existence mm. a devil is going to come out a very large devil and he's going to look down at you and be like yeah, it looks like my servant has done it again so my friend what happens next <laughs> we'll keep you here until we have a use for you my name is Asmodeus <laughs> and you are my slave I don't know what that is would you like to make a deal I know Asmodeus <laughs> Oh, who doesn't? <laughs> oh, that's so... Uh, he's so powerful. As well, yeah, he's, he's like... God. And he's he loves making yeah. deals. <laughs> he's what the type of, of deal, the uh, uh, deal do you want? Make me an off. <laughs> oh, you got balls to come in dump trucks, dude. <laughs> How about this? It's not this? a of gold. I'm going to be pissed. I will let you go back to your friends. And long from now, after you pass away, 
I will give you a new job. One that can accelerate, uh, that you can accelerate through your already born in cruelty. Hmm. How do you like the sound of that? I don't suppose... <laughs> I could get a little boom as well. To accelerate this. A risk-reward factor. Nothing burns hotter than a candle. Mahadi has something for you when you return. Oh, shit. <laughs> the offer is most acceptable, Asmodeus. I look forward to seeing you in the future. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, at that point in time he's going to unroll <laughs> he's going to have actually a uh, Mimir a low rank demon and he's going to hand you a quill and say go ahead sign thy name Damien's gonna drag the quill across his arm uh, gathering his blood onto it and then flourishly go at that point in time, you will return back. But before that happens, who's drawing the card next? I'll go. <laughs> What'd he get? You must, he got balance. Fuck. You must change to a radically different alignment. If you fail to act according to the new alignment, you gain a negative level. Oh. So, Marnin, what is your oh, alignment? No. What he's, is my alignment? He's lawful it good, is chaotic. He? It is chaotic good. You are chaotic. now lawful evil. Well, oh. radically, <laughs> oh, shit. radically different. Wouldn't that be chaotic evil? Fuck this dick, man. <laughs> no, it, it's, he's chaotic good, so dramatically uh, different. Yeah. You're right. Would be lawful evil. I always go to be, the opposite. He'd be Damien's new bestie. Pretty yeah, much. Basically, you and yeah, you're lawful evil. All right. I'm gonna, cut, I'm gonna add that to your movies. sheet. So right. you get the cut, sense cut, 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 that you have to follow the rules and make sure you come, you or the person or the person you work for, comes out on top. Mm -hmm. I can do that. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Follow my lead. <laughs> uh, Rudy, I will go next, but cut the deck in half, please, and draw the top. Okay. On or about. It doesn't have to be perfect. Yep, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. So, Holmes is going to draw. Draw. Holmes. My boy. <laughs> you got gem. Ooh, oh, nice. Oh, nice. Gain your choice of 25 pieces of jewelry or 50 gems. The jewelry is all gold, set with gems. Each piece worth 2,000 gold. The gems are worth 1,000 gold each. So basically, you got 50,000 gold worth of stuff. Right. He finally has money. <laughs> <laughs> I don't fucking care about money. But I'll tell you what, I have enough to pay for this goddamn trip 25 times over. <laughs> So, I'm finally going to listen to you. <laughs> you, want the you want the gems or the jewelry? Um, You know what? Being in the area we're in right now, I want the gems. Oh, rather the jewelry. Because the jewelry is a... It, I can sell it really quick. Okay. You want jewelry? Yeah. Jewelry is like... gold a pop. Yep. Can you How give me the, the seventh card? The seventh card? Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, like we'll put like we'll put it in as gems because I can find those a lot easier, and just call like and we'll just call it. Uh, that's fine. That's that, that's thing. fine. And you got fifty thousand. Yep. I don't yep. tell anybody. I don't tell anybody about it. It's, oh no, yeah, they see it. Total. Yeah. Oh, it just comes. Yeah, it's not oh, something wow. that you can get away from. You just look like Mahadi now. <laughs> He's Mister T. So how much? Is, how much is each gem is worth? Is worth two thousand dollars? Well, each jewelry is worth two thousand. Each gem is worth one thousand. You can pick either gems or jewelry. Okay, yeah. so I have to do gems. It's all Brian's tracking. So Don't worry, Brian, I can change it later. Yeah. yeah. So it's the, you will each have, worth a thousand. You will have twenty jewelry pieces, each worth or minute. 
Yeah. The, the oh. jewelry. The jewelry's were. Oh, that's not good. Nope. Am I dying? No, you're not dying, dear. But all your non-magical possessions are lost. This includes Mother all wealth fucker. and real property. Fuck. Don't oh, worry, man. Goes. I'll buy some new shit. My great sword. <sighs> nope. It's magical. Nope. It's magical. non-magical. Yeah, you're oh. magical. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, we're getting worry, home, twenty thousand. Uh, twenty thousand gold for homes, and then I have to take all that stuff off for you. Fifty thousand. Was it fifty thousand or twenty thousand? It, it's fifty thousand. It's, it's fifty thousand total. Fifty thousand. So I'll do forty thousand. I'll do forty thousand jewelry and ten thousand gems. I'll fix it later. Take, but yeah, you 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 have everything. Ren has nothing. Okay, except for so her magical this, items. This is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take okay, a gem. I got piece. my slippers. I, I, yeah. I, I flick it. I flick. But I flick. Your the backpack gem, gem is gone. Go. Your bedroll is gone. Your traveler clothes are gone. Uh, your javelins are gone. Mace, goodbye. The manacles are non magical. Mess kit gone. Well, that was not supposed to be there anymore anyway. Uh, that pouch is gone. All of your rations are gone. Oh, that hurts. Ju Ouch. Junior, Junior, go get a blanket. I lose my clothes, like all my clothes. Yeah, you lost your clothes as well. Um, yeah. She's nude in the desert. Oh, well, have much. a good look, boys. <laughs> I don't. Look, I, I. I don't. Like, look. No, Junior's I, gonna cover up his eyes. Yeah, yeah. And then he's gonna go like back. I mean, I have the smoldering <laughs> leather armor. I don't know if that'll help. She cannot wear armor. Or she'll lose a, uh, AC and a lot of yep. abilities. Yep. But there you go. Right. You have a bag of holding, bracers of defense, an infused great holders, sword, that, that, that a potion of horrors, uh, heroism, a ring of free action, and wing boots. That is all you have on your person. Oh, okay. Hmm. Okay. Blanket, please. <laughs> Something to At cover about this time, uh, uh, Junior, he's going to come up and throw you a robe. Thank you. Like just, just some stuff. Like stuff. And Mahadi's going to be like, ah, only two got uh, got ruined. Oh well. And he's going to pick oh, up, like, uh, take the cards, put it in. At about that time, um, Rudy, uh, Damien, you pop back into existence. I like to think he appears like a wreath of flames. <laughs> <clears throat> if that's what you um, want, go ahead. You'll come back yeah. in flames. It's because it looks cool to come out that way. Instead <laughs> of just like winking in there, it's more like, you know, he came up from the hells. Well, normally I would hug you. I'm glad that you're back. But, you know, I'm just kind of just chilling in this robe. I wouldn't say only two of us got ruined. I found this most fortuitous. As Modia said, you had something for me, Mahati. Oh, you're actually going to say who has it? Yeah, hundred percent. I'd like to think now, uh, Damien's like his coat, like uh, his mm -hmm. uh, is branded with Asmodeus' uh, sigil. <clears throat> like second, he said with Modia. It, like, I feel like all of us are like that the emblem on you is the one that's on the caravan. Yep. So, and you saw those emblems. When you were uh, in his palace. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let me uh, find this particular weapon that Mahadi always carries. This will be attunement. I believe it is legendary. Goody. <laughs> awesome. You traded your soul for a magical weapon. <laughs> right? Worth it. Well, not really. He said service. He didn't say that. He didn't say soul. He said, yeah, service. You said service. He didn't say soul. Yep. You will be in my oh, service. No, like, it was written in common. Yeah. He knows that he sold his soul. 100%. Yeah. He just okay with it. Yeah. <laughs> it, the way he's looking, it's like, I'm just going to have more time to learn more shit. Hmm. And Damien would have noticed 
that like according to it the uh more help he is on the mortal plane the more he's going oh crap my fantasy grounds just crashed no uh, that's a very specific thought for damien to have <laughs> um that like fantasy grounds the more he does in service to asmodeus uh the higher rank he will get like on the mortal plane the higher rank he will have in the nine hells oh no. and Damn. he would definitely know that oh yeah but you will get if i can gosh dang it no that's npc i want items i love this deck so much <laughs> i had yeah, i had to bring it in at oh, least once it's one of my favorite things Can't yeah say i'm a fan okay i had I had to roll the dice. Why is. did people give me that choice? You he said the magic words. You... Trust me. <laughs> he will hand you a mace. Bye, mace. My fucker. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a magical, so probably not. I will make sure this is identified. It is up to you for you to tell anybody. Damien's gonna scowl a little and <clears throat> when he looks at it, it's like I was hoping for something of a bit more finesse. Well, once you read it, you'll understand. Uh Ren. Mm. Go search out a caravan. Pick up there it is. You want, let me know how much it costs. Okay? Uh, mm. In my inventory? Yep. Okay. Yeah, what, uh, whatever you want. Uh, will do. You will notice you. that, mm -hmm. and I will show you guys what mace, like what his new mace looks like. Oh, oh nice. Sweet. Very nice. Ooh, it's double sided. Oh, okay, there we go. Rod it's got a business end and a pokey end. It does. For his pleasure. <laughs> it's got Rod, some gems. But you would notice that gems, if you can. Hit the buttons, it will be something different. Ooh. But it will yeah, be we're... just, it looks like just a regular mace with six buttons on the side. Oh, yeah, see the buttons. Nice. <clears throat> like, you're just going to keep it on one, right? Yes, most likely. Because I can't really use it. Well, um, I can, just not. Which one are you going to move it over to? Probably the scimitar one. Oh, uh, you know, screw it. We'll do rape here. We'll do rape here. Okay. That is not what it's supposed to be. So since you'll just keep it over on the rape here for basically <coughs> the entire time, I'll throw that one in there. But you guys will notice that Damien will hit a button and the rod will turn into a rapier. Nice. Hmm. So it, it it could be six different weapons. That's pretty. Bad. You would probably assume that. Because it has six buttons, he hit a button and it changed. Hmm. Nice. What else can we assume? That you would need to cast identify unless he tells you. Because this weapon has a lot. He's going to have to play around with that. That's going to take some time. Let's just say oh, Damien's yeah. not going to need another weapon. <laughs> no. Ever. I mean, I was quite happy with the scimitar wounding speed to be perfectly fair, uh, but this thing is just. <laughs> yeah. He's like, ah, another added to our number. And he'll throw the mace, uh, like he'll, when he throws the mace. But it looks like everybody at least came out. So, so since mine is an alignment, does everybody know that now or what? Like, not really. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, what the like, fuck? <laughs> you know that Damien disappeared everybody knew that yeah 
<laughs> uh, you saw 5,000 gold pieces get delivered to homes from the right. air. 50, and you saw that I'm Ren jealous. lost I'm all jealous. of her non-magical stuff. You would know that you feel me. different, but they won't be able to tell that yet. Gotcha. You just feel like angry and no, not even that. It's just no, like it's not whatever, everything everything Damien said suddenly makes a lot of sense. Yep. Yeah, that's kind of where I was going with a lot of that. And he's like, so yes, these our deal is complete. You may travel with us. Let's go. I need, to, I need to get some stuff before we go. Uh, yeah, yeah. Of course. Uh, we have uh, we have plenty of places that can make stuff for you here. And we'll okay. gladly serve you. So basically, I just want my stuff back. <laughs> Brian, Brian, what's the price of her stuff that she lost? Ballpark. It wasn't that much, honestly. Okay. It was Whatever maybe, it maybe like two or three hundred gold. Two or three hundred gold? How much is a gem? A gem is worth a thousand? Yeah, each I'll one of those it. gems that you have in there is two grand. Jewelry is a, is a thousand. We'll and I want that. a unicorn, unicorn necklace. <laughs> Red, I mean, while you're, while you're at it. Roll a d100. Oh, that should be me. Roll a d100. I said 100, oh, not 10. I'm sorry, I grabbed the wrong thing. No, that's probably better that you grabbed the wrong thing, because... Yeah. There we go. 25. <laughs> he does not have a unicorn necklace. All right, fair enough. Lame. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll I'll break up one of the gems and... Would you say two, two or 300? I, I didn't hear what you said. It, it wasn't really that much. Like okay. she yeah. has plenty of money, she could get it, like get it all back with basically nothing. No, I'll pay for it. I don't give a fuck about. No. Uh, the <laughs> thing is, the guy who doesn't give a fuck about money gets gets the money. money. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean, if you don't care about money, I'll take your money. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> you already gave enough of my stuff away. <laughs> But thank you. <clears throat> I'll you do it again. If you want to give her uh, one of them, that's fine. And she can I, go I, and buy everything yeah. that she lost, which we will like. I will set up for next week. Thank you. I give her. I give her a purple gem that's unicorn shaped. <laughs> See, dreams do come true. By <laughs> your wish. Oh. <laughs> Right, oh, yeah, Sarah, we survived the deck of many things. Nice. And only one person ever, lost I, I, their soul. I, I don't want to ever do that again. I didn't <laughs> lose my soul. I freely gave it. I <laughs> kind of want to do that again. <laughs> That's I the reason have... why the DM should never give it to his players. And if he does, <laughs> only once. Because <laughs> I know how broken it is. One your time use is fun. <laughs> Can we do it again? And it sit there. Just looking at it is the worst thing you can do. It, it's so it's so funny. Me and Guy, like, I wish ours was reversed. Because I would gladly take on the next opponent that comes against us and hopefully beat them. Yeah. You won't be there. But anyway. No, I, I, I know, I know. <laughs> but anyway, uh, at about this time, you guys have made your deal. Uh, Mahadi will give you uh, basically some keys for a hotel that is inside the town. So that way you guys do have a place to stay. Oh, sweet. Is there a cafeteria? Uh, you will find that like one of the caravan things. Since you are now part of the caravan, you can eat at their uh, place. The food nice. truck. Yeah, they got Wait. a food truck. This is a taco <laughs> truck. Oh, please, please tell me they got a taco but, truck. Right now, because this is probably taking maybe an hour, it's not dinner time. Mahdi's gonna be <laughs> like, "We're gonna leave. Uh, we're gonna leave right after dinner." Make sure to take uh, take turns. It's better to travel at night in the desert. This is why you needed me. Mm, take turns through the night. Make sure you get plenty of rest. But do not worry about the lookout. We will not be attacked. 
Oh. Alrighty then. Junior didn't pull a card. <laughs> oh, wow. what, what was that, Heather? I said Junior didn't pull one of the cards. <laughs> we were not making the deal. I already have everything I need for him, from him. Yeah, it was Dad. Yeah, it's... Well, it was Dad's soul. Yeah. Yeah, that's all. Yeah. Listen, deals are made, and people live with it. You know, the things people do for their kids. I agree with Damien. <laughs> all of a sudden. Oh. <laughs> what? What? Hey, oh, and uh, Damien, because mm. of your special your uh, special trip, you will see Mahadi for what he is. If I can find it. You're Rudy all smiling. I am. I love Asmodeus. He's one of my favorite people. Yes. <laughs> if I can find Asmodeus him. Asmodeus is awesome. I, I, I agree. I use him a lot in campaigns just because he fits into like pretty much there everything. There we are. He's very chaotic. He's very, he's very lawful. So yeah, this is what uh, Mahadi looks like. Yep. <laughs> this is what you guys basically all see. Hey, oh, hey, hey. Hey, yo, hey. Is this hey, gentleman? Hey. But, Damon, you see something different. You do not see uh, the older human man. You see a bipedal humanoid tiger. Avrashashasha. So basically, for that. our people at home, Vesper Cheeto. <laughs> this is what Damien sees. Called it Vrashasha. Nice. Huh. Yeah, they, uh, <laughs> He absolutely would have no trouble smoking us. But the rest of you do not see that. You still see the human being. Yeah. It's actually made of a pretty decent card of magic. Yeah, those are pretty nasty, uh, nasty yep. things to uh, come I, I make it a point to pronounce his name very well now. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Mighty Mouse, or whatever the fuck your name is. <laughs> You're, and again, <laughs> again, Holmes, you do not, you still don't know who this person is. No, I know, I know, I know. No, but when I knew, like, there was something about him that I, that was a stir of the Kool Aid, that I know he could absolutely kill us. Yeah, that's when he, yeah, that's when I'm divided attention. <laughs> like, he, he, even my smart mouth is not going to go off anymore. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, you get the feeling yeah. that he's going to own you. Yep. Or that he oh, feels oh. that he can own you. Yeah. That's good enough by me. Anyway, gonna, uh, gonna... as you guys buy your things <clears throat> and whatnot, which I'll find out how that how much that is for you, Ren, and uh, take it out of your thing. But you do have a thousand from homes, so you, you have plenty. Um, you. After dinner, after about like an hour of serving, uh, Mahadi is going to uh, <coughs> be like, okay. It is time for us uh, to leave. Where are we going? <laughs> he just looks at you. Well, like, are you yelling this out? Because you guys aren't near the front. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh. What's your name? <laughs> Tony! <laughs> Mahati! That ain't fucking sucks. <laughs> anyway, as you guys yell, he notices you're yelling. And he's just going to basically ignore you. As he should. <laughs> uh, guys, I, I just say, listen, it's nighttime. We should all get some sleep. Uh, we'll, we'll set up a watch within our own little... We're inside a caravan, right? Like inside a, yeah. a tr wagon. <coughs> type thing. Mm. But both, like, Rudy, or excuse me, Damien, would know that Rush, uh, Mahadi 
has given his word that you guys only need to drive. And he knows that that will stay. Yep. So it's up to you okay. guys. It feels like somebody made a pact. <laughs> But it's up to you guys if you guys like I'm letting Damien I'm letting Rudy know that. Because the rest of you guys may not trust him. But Rudy thinks this guy is swell. He's right <laughs> on the level. <laughs> if Damien trusts him, I trust him. I don't trust him, but he's our escort, so there's that. Look this way, he gave us his word. His word is his bot. If it were ever broken, then his credibility goes right out the window. Damien trusts him, and Double D told us to trust him. What, what more do you want? <laughs> it's a means uh, to an end. But you also have said trust you. Look what happened. <laughs> oh, never trust me. Now you so, say it. I've said this so many times. Are you and I taking turns driving through the night then? Yes, that's probably for the best. All right. And as with that, you guys get onto the uh, train, and Mahadi leads you all out into the desert. You just have like Aladdin's or Arabian Nights going off in my head. <laughs> Arabian yeah. Nights. <laughs> like right. Anyway, uh, that is going to be the end of our stream. <laughs> <laughs> and it's our gonna recording. end with bad I know I have to go pick up my son, so oh. I do have to get going. And I think that's a pretty good place to stop. Yeah. Uh, before before I vanish, disappear out, of, disappear out of existence, I slip one of the gems in Lenore's pocket. Okay. Aww. I like money. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. I mean, like I'm money. pretty sure you have enough gold. <laughs> I just gave him a thousand. Yeah. Go ahead, roll sleight of hand. Mm -hmm. Too easy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, guy, you're not going to. And you gave 16. one to Ren. Mm hmm. And, uh, and I'll, I'll personally give one to. Um, to Damien and Marnin. Why am I not using sleight of hand more often? Right? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, so you're going to give each one of them an opal? I, I, I'm going to give e each one of them a gem. So they each okay. have a thousand on them. Damien just said in the um, caravan, like with the fucking right here. Yeah, 16. <laughs> the only person who would notice. Uh, what's your passive perception, Marnin? Uh, 17, I think. I hate when people say, I think. No, yeah. it's, it's 17. I just, I had to pull up the tab. <coughs> Double Sorry. check. So you would <laughs> notice that Holmes slips you, uh, some jewelry. Yeah. I appreciate that. Hey, home. Ren, Marnin, Lenoris. Oh, it's actually two, isn't it? Not just one. Because they're two thousand dollars a piece. Uh, it doesn't the matter. Jeweler, the jewelry is two thousand a piece. The gems are a thousand. So it's what not I that did was, deal. yeah, I just did. I, I'm, I just broke it up as in forty jewelry in ten gems. So I have six gems in forty jewelry on. Oh, sorry, twenty jewelry on. So. Don't worry about it. Jewelry. I'll fix it yeah. later. Yeah. It, it, I have 46,000. Whatever. I mean, <laughs> fix it in post. <laughs> yeah, six times post. But, yeah, you will feel that he puts something in your pocket. Everybody else does not know. I knew. because That, I, far, uh, that I know of. Before I blink out of existence, I say, check your pockets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Martin is the only one who won. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Martin is the only one that knows that you put something in their pocket. Yeah. By the way, that was an eight roll. And I, I fooled almost everybody here. Mm. <laughs> it's a stupid. But idea. anyway, that's where we'll end oh, our God. stream. Uh, we'll Sweet. go ahead, go to uh, shout outs. Mr. Guy. Uh, shout out to Big Box Dave. Thanks for coming, man. Thanks yeah, for thank being you. here. 
Uh, I love giving away all your cards, and um, you. It's been fun. <laughs> blinked right out of existence. He blinked right out. He totally blinked out. <laughs> I don't blame him. Always yeah. count your change. <laughs> <laughs> um, Mr. Rudy. Like to uh, you know, give a shout out to the deck of many things for always making something both better and worse at the same time. And I just threw the jester. Nice. Uh, which I actually care for, for that card. Yeah, no, but seriously, uh, great job. Thank you, Brian, for always playing a great game. Thank you for Big Box Game for Big Box Dave for joining us and allowing us to give away your marsh flats and cavernous souls on the wonderful <laughs> island. <laughs> Heather. I just want to give a shout out to you, Brian, for having us here for the shenanigans for running the game. And also to everybody that is viewing, has jumped in tonight, that has subscribed. Thank you guys for everything. Uh, Dave. Uh, I want to give out to the shout out to the Rusty Fork that would be stabbing in the face. Uh, I need you to speak up. You're getting too low. <laughs> oh, you're mumbling. Yeah. Can you guys hear me now? Yeah. yeah. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, I want to give a shout out to the rusty fork that I'm going to use to stab myself in the face over. It. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. You're you're still kind of mumbling. I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. With every fiber of my body. Right Are you guys now. in the same room? <laughs> no. 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 He's no. looking like over <laughs> here. <laughs> no, I'm look. I'm lo I'm looking at him, but no, there's nobody in there. Okay, <laughs> it's just me. Uh, Tony, love you, Dave. Yeah. Uh, to give a shout out to all these amazing content creators, and uh, thank you, Brian. Thank you, Dave, for showing up. Uh, it's always a blast when you uh come gracious with your presence, regardless of how many souls or um flats you've lost. Uh, <laughs> and uh, Fuck, man. <laughs> Uh, shout out to uh, Pipe Dream Gaming for always hosting an incredible game. <clears throat> and go check out all of these content creators. These guys are amazing. Yeah. Anyway, uh, as for me, uh, I want to thank Big Box Dave. Uh, we've been friends for a number of years. Uh, fantastic channel over on YouTube. Uh, MTG Attitude. And if you're wondering what's going on about us saying that we're giving out a bunch of magic cards that cost hundreds of dollars. That's because somebody did. And that was uh, posted. Was it Monday? Yeah, that was. Yep. Yep. So yes. go sub and watch that video. <clears throat> and also, uh, if you want to help support the channel, use HelloFresh. Use Hello my Fresh. code. <coughs> and uh, the code is going to be. E it. It's going to be in the description below. Thank you. <laughs> I, I always forget you. which page it's on. Like, always drives me nuts. I just wrote it down. No, 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 no. It's yeah. Slap dance, slap dance. Slap it's dance. basically Pog HF 6007. I think, I think what you're looking at is different than what I'm looking at. <laughs> yeah, we're in different sections, but yes, anyway. Look anyway, up, please go Look over... All the links for these fantastic people are all going to be in the links in the description below. <laughs> and uh, we will see you uh, on this channel for D&D &D in one week from now. And, of course, I do uh, Magic the Gathering over the weekends. Everybody have a wonderful night, and I will see you next time. Bye. Bye. Later. Later.